Well, hello there. How are we doing today? I didn't know how to start. I did the same thing where I thought I was live and I did my whole intro and nobody was listening, but that's okay because I can, I kind of like messed it up a little bit. So I may as well get another retake. So yes, today is kind of special because this is my second year anniversary on YouTube. I made my first video June 23rd of 2020. So that was like shortly after lockdown and stuff, right? And in my first year, I got 107 subscribers. And then, of course, now it's been two years and we're in a much, a much different and better place. So I'm very happy and very thankful. So I thought I would just like come on and we'll we'll play some Sims. We'll pet some cat like, you know, like I just want it to be relaxed and like no ulterior motive, I guess, other than putting a cat in the thumbnail to like get clicks. But other than that, we're just going to kind of keep it nice. And I just thought that's such a beautiful picture of Kyle. I just wanted to share it kind of with everybody anyway. Hello, everybody. OK, hi. Oh, good. I'm sad, sad, sad trumpet. I thought you said sad Trump. And I'm like, I'm I should be watching the, the January 6th hearing, but I'm going live instead because it's more fun. Okie doke. Let's see. I'm, I'm going to pop out my chat so I can just kind of get it closer to my my screen. I'm going to put myself in the middle, too. So I'll just look straight ahead because we're not playing the game yet. I'm going to play the game. Hi, Katharina. Hi, Ezra. Hi, Federica. Hi, Fernanda. Hi, Natalie. Oh, my God. Comments here. Hi. Oh, my God. Everybody's here. I figured I figured people like kind of like to see Kyle anyway. And he sleeps in like I haven't touched him yet. Like he doesn't know what's going on yet. I haven't prepared him for this, but he's just kind of having his nap or whatever. Right. And he always sleeps in a way where like he's visible regardless. In my last few videos, I didn't even mention him. People are just like, oh, my God, Kyle. Right. Because he'll just jump behind me or something. Oh, my God. Ginger Cat Queen's here. That is of no surprise to me. I figured I figured you'd make it for a Kyle stream. Hello, hello. Selena's here. Hi. Kyle is amazing. I know. He's just he's so cute. Just like right there. He's cuter than me. I don't know why I'm I don't know why I'm front and center. So I'm going to go. Actually, you know, what? I'm going to open my drink first because he doesn't he doesn't like the sound of cans opening because it sounds kind of like a hiss, right? Like it sounds like somebody's hissing. Mim, you're here. Hi. Thank you. Oh, my God. I see. I see the yellow toilet. I love it. Oh, and Michael's got his yellow toilet, too. So basically, if you become a member of the channel, not only can you put Kyle emojis in stuff places, but um, actually, I'm going to be adding more because I think I can. As soon as I get a couple more members, they'll let me add more. See, Kyle's eyes are opening because I'm holding the can. He's looking at the can. He's not going to like this. OK, he didn't move too much. That's good. He's kind of I don't know. I haven't I haven't really used. um used energy drinks like I say it like it's drugs I have not really been drinking energy drinks for the last month or two it's a bit of a frivolous expense and like I'll just drink a coffee in the morning and that's fine look at him oh he's stretched oh my god he's just I love him so much. Yes, look at the Kyle emoji. Mim's got the, Mim's got it going on. I want to add toilet emojis. Like I want different. Look at his face. I can't. I, he's always looking grumpy. He is handsome. I know, right? He's just oh my god, stretching so much. I love it. He he is kind of chunky. So he so he's on a diet just to get him back in like a healthy weight range, and he's just about there. It was just because. I was having uh, he was living with a second cat and like that cat needs to be fed anyway. It's hard to feed two cats exactly how they need to be fed when they're both different. Right. So now I have Kyle in a controlled environment where I just have him on his diet food. And no matter how much he complains, he only gets whatever I'm supposed to give him. Right. So he's been losing weight. But it's like he's got so much fur that like I didn't even notice he lost weight until he had his last bath because like all the fur like shrunk down. OK, so I, I'm going to have my drink. It's weird, like to stop talking It's because <laughs> I don't I don't usually do that. Oh, my God. Hi, everybody. Hi. Hi, gaming cats. <laughs> cats always make me click videos that honestly, I'll be honest, like it was. That that was in the back of my mind. I thought, you know what? For the people who aren't clicking for Sunset Valley, they can click because I want to renovate some of Sunset Valley today. But I do want to make Kyle in the game, too. So there's a few things I want to do. He looks tired, but he's always tired. He's always sleeping. He needs he needs a little more activity. So I thought this would be a good way to get him engaged, too, because he'll only play for like 10 minutes. He's lazy, right? He's a he. 
I don't know what the traits are for pets again. We'll have to know when we get into the game, but I know for sure Piggy is one of them. He's a Piggy. I call him Piggy. Kyle's getting commission. Kyle, honestly, okay, well, I just got back from London Drugs and I had to buy him like litter and food because he's big. Like, because even though he's on a diet, he's still like the largest cat breed that I'm allowed to have in a house. So he's, you know, he, he eats as much as a dog. So it's, it could be, it could be more economical to have a smaller cat, but I love him too much. You had a cherry orange chocolate microwave mug cake with no sugar. That sounds awful. I'm sorry. Like, <laughs> I mean, like, it's only because I don't. Okay, I don't like chocolate. Number one, I hate chocolate. Number two, I hate fruit and chocolate together. That's way worse than just chocolate. And then no sugar. So I'm just, I don't know. For me, I'm sure it's great for other people. People love these things. They're called Terry's chocolate oranges. Those things I think should be illegal. Like, they are so gross. And I've seen people just, well, <laughs> anyway, it's awful. I'll just drink my can of chemicals, thank you. So he doesn't even really fuss when I pick him up, right? I'm gonna, tr I'm gonna try and not block his face. Oh my god. I... <laughs> He'll just like flop all the way down if I don't hold him up. Okay, there we go. We got him. We're just petting Kyle. I'm sure it's good for you. I hope, I hope you enjoy it. I like your, your, your cake reminds me of The Sims 4. It's just not for me. And if somebody else wants to enjoy it, then they can absolutely do that. Who am I to say any different, even though that's all I do? Yeah, let's get him here. I can probably move this down. This is Kyle. Let's see if I can get him purring into the microphone because he's purring. God. Yeah, he is probably bigger than your dog. He's like 20 something pounds, I think. When I stretch him out, he's way bigger. Like he's he's clumped up. Like this is my like look at him compared to me. Like I like I am an adult man. <sighs> <laughs> he said something. Did you hear it? I know, right? Oh my god. So cute. Oh, he's making noises. Hey Kyle. He there okay, so our so our window's open and I just heard a bird and now I hear girls laugh. Excuse me, girls laughing. So he's like, what's that? Hi, sorry you have to go to bed. Oh god, oh, he's gotta go. Okay, that's fine. He'll be back anyway. I'll be back up in his because now he's going to his food dish he thinks he's going to get food and then when he realizes he's not getting food well he kind of needs food soon because he hasn't eaten since this morning so i figured i would allocate some of his allowed food for like treats or whatever i don't know mm, hi yeah this is the thing like if you don't know yeah like i'm <sighs> I like I don't know too too much about cats like I know about my like my type of cat and stuff but I do know that mine's the biggest which was not warned to me when I got him no nobody told me this they're just like he's awesome that's it and I and he is and I believed it and I should have but they should have let me know that he was going to turn into like a lynx right lynx are bigger than him but He's probably closer to the size of a lynx than your cat is to the size of him, if that makes sense. I don't know. I don't know too much about cats, but I saw my friend's cats the other day. So, so uh, sorry, I'm trying to open the game too, trying to get everything done at once. So, yeah. What did I just say? I just had like a memory thing. You know, like when you're saying something, it just goes away. That happens to me too. But when I'm recording, I can just cut it out and then I don't have to tell anybody. Sometimes I'll say that. I'll just like, I'll be recording and then I'll say, Okay, cut out that last sentence. That was stupid, right? And just like critique myself. Like, what's wrong with you? Okay. Oh my God, it's trying to sell me the werewolves pack. Save up to 75% on our hottest games now through July 7th. Give me one second. I'm just going to see if the Sims, the Sims 3 packs are on sale again. Because if they are, I know a few people who'd be interested. 
they are not on sale. Well, at least at least this one isn't. So that's so, that, so that's weird. Yeah, brain fart. Not Kyle's gonna lick himself now, but he'll be like close close by even like while I get stuff up. Like I said, he sits in a way where he's always kind of involved <laughs> in the stream or in the recording. Okay, my game library. Uh, even just like clicking on Origin hurts me. Okay, I'm gonna put my chat over, get the game launching. <laughs> so <laughs> if my if my stream abruptly stops, it's because I tried to open The Sims 3. <laughs> well, <clears throat> how uh, how's everybody doing? What are we doing? Is everybody up to what is it, Wednesday? Wednesday or Thursday? Thursday already. Oh my god. Human interactions. No, this is this is enough for me. Actually, I did I did leave the house today. I didn't really speak to anybody other than the cashier, though. Oh, yeah, I got all that social anxiety stuff, too. I'm just I'm really good at overcompensating with my personality just to like kind of mask it. I'm good at masking like I can I can appear very normal, very put together, very calm. That is never the case ever. <laughs> but it's fun, too. You just slot in with different people. I'm like, I'm just going to pretend to be like them for 10 minutes. One thing that is hard for me, though, is faking interest in sports. That's very difficult for me to do. Yeah, my sports team. Like, no. I don't look like the sports type either, right? Like, I just don't, I don't have that look. I can pull off nerd, I can pull off socialite, but I can't really pull off sports. Is it hot where I am? Okay, so today it isn't. Yesterday was so, so hot, I can't even explain. Like, I was, ugh, it was awful. It was like 27 or 28 degrees, which isn't that warm, but in where, where I live, that, that is, oh my god, why is this thing here? Report. Um, why are they always trying to... It doesn't matter how many emojis you I'm cuter than than those kiss emojis. So there, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. This spam is crazy. I, like it always follows me. They're always they're always popping into my streams to try to entice people to go over to um to their trashy website. OK, so I've successfully opened the game. That's very good. Let's see what else. What else are we going to do? Mods are being harassed. Yeah, I tried to click them off. Oh my god, now the now the game is so loud. Okay. I need to I need to add the desktop audio. And then I don't know how loud is too loud. Okay. What are we doing? <laughs> I might just pop into my Sunset Valley Reno save file because that's kind of where I kind of want to go with it. But I guess we can make Kyle pretty much anywhere. I'm having a hard time navigating chat stream a game and a cat where is my chat there it is okay sorry i can't see anything rec will dm later thank you okay great that sounds that sounds great i know and like and so i always i always ban them i always do like let's see i put hide user on the channel right and then they should I don't know if they disappear, but they shouldn't be able to put any new ones, right? So as long as I'm paying attention, it's just sometimes I look away. You should have Roseanne join the debate club since she's working on a politician. Yes, so I'm actually working on like a short film to bridge Roseanne into like late teenagehood because I don't want to play out 14 days of her being a teenager and him being an adult and them just going to work, school, and the casino. I want to kind of bridge it into the narrative, right? So I have a couple scene ideas and stuff. I'm going to play around with it or whatever. So I have not tried recreating Kyle as a pet. That's what I thought we would do today. So I'm, I'm almost there, guys. Okay. Sunset Valley. Just open up Sunset Valley. <laughs> yeah, warm days. I don't like warm days either. I don't like the heat. I like it to be about 15 degrees. Actually, today it's 15 degrees, but it's also storming out. So like I had to go to the store in... I would say torrential level rain, like we're having flooding problems and stuff now, right? So like it isn't, 
It is certainly not typical of my part of the world. I live in the sunniest city in North America. Like, I think it's like 30 or sorry, in Canada, it's like uh, 300 plus days of sunlight a year. And it's been cloudy and raining for like two weeks. But of course, we need our precious oil and gas. So what can we do? You're playing The Sims 3 right now. Custom world called Red, Red County. I, um, there's, there is this simmer. His name is CJ Plays. And he reviews all of the like custom worlds and stuff. So I haven't heard of that one. But that would be the first place I would go to see if he knew. Because then he would have done a video about it. Right? There's some pet size sliders. Yeah, so I have to make him big. I think in The Sims 4, I made him a dog and then made him look like a cat because he acts like a dog too. Okay, so I've got, I've got the game open. I just have to kind of transition myself. Let's see. If I turn off this camera. Okay, I got this. I'm there. Except my camera is now dim for some reason. I have no idea why this does this. It just randomly started doing it at some point, And now I have to change it when I switch cameras. There are new towns available for your sit. No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not moving. I'm not placing nothing. So I just popped into like my reno save file. So this is like the land grab mansion. I don't care. I'm not playing. I'm just I'm creating in this save. OK, we're just going to let the Sims 3 kind of catch up. Oh, God, of course, it's raining now, so it's going to be lagging. Oh, my God, the future thing. No, because I think I just loaded this save file with only the base game before. There we go. <laughs> Gone. Like, as, as if she needs more money. Actually, she does need more money because I ran out of money building this. Okay, where is my... There we go. The pet size sliders are a mod. Okay, no. 45 Celsius? Yeah, so that's like... So I'm from Niagara, and it's usually like 35 or 40 there in the summer nowadays, and it's ridiculous. Like, I can't even breathe. Living in the United States, I would die because I can't afford air conditioning, so I would just die. Like, I, I wouldn't be able to survive in that, in that temperature for that... For that long, for the love of God, just catch up. I loaded all the expansion packs and stuff too, so it so it kind of has to do its uh, cash loading thing. Okie doke. Yeah, so this is the land grab mansion. If you missed the speed build, uh, I took away all the ugly wood. I took away all the ugly yellow, and I turned it into just like, you know, like the, you know those mansions like where they're so clean that you're scared to like breathe on it that's kind of what i was going for with this so i made like lots of white marbles i made like deep rich colors but nothing too abhorrent right kind of thing so 31 celsius i do not i'm so glad i'm not i'm not dealing with that i just want to show the master bathroom because this is like my favorite room in the house and i actually didn't even really change it too much this was the only room that kind of looked nice i think i styled it up a bit but yeah they had this statue i think and they had the chair and i thought mm, that's actually kind of it's kind of all right i don't mind the chair in the bathroom because it's not like next to the toilet so it's not going to get any splash back right so that's our land grab house. So I'm thinking we're going to renovate smaller houses today. Maybe we can do two if we if we do something smaller. So thank you so much. Oh, my God. See, the thing is, I don't think I have particularly great taste. That's why I like to preface things like I'll say something like this is my kind of ugly. Right. So I don't so like I'm not saying that this that this weird thing is beautiful. It's more like this is my style. Right. And I know some people will hate it. But this I tried to make a little more uh digestible for the masses right like i think most people would see this as a rich fancy house oh my god green there was so much yellow and green in malcolm's room like over here this bathroom and this in this living ew it was so gross i this was the worst part of the whole build and then this bedroom was ugly too it was like a weird blue i think i don't i don't really remember yeah and i put flowers and stuff i don't know what i did Malcolm married Bella in your save and I and you didn't know how to feel about it. I don't know how I feel about it either, but they're kind of the right age, right? Okay, let's go into edit town. Then we're going to make Kyle. I'll bring him back over and we'll kind of get his uh, 
features going and whatnot, right? Okay. Create a household. Oh, I don't want to create a household. I just want to create him. <laughs> That's okay. So here we are in my in my weakest state of um of create a sim. Okay. Where's Sure, he can be we can just kill the guy later. Oh, I have to move my face, right, for create a sim. So I'm gonna just bear with me. I'm in a good mood. Usually I'm kind of bitchy, but today I'm not as bitchy. So hopefully we'll have like a more positive experience. I'm trying to be less aggressive. But then I just see like, and then EA just does something, right? And I can't help it. Okay, where's my, where's my chat? Hello. You always destroyed their family. They did Malcolm Dirty. Yes. All, all the packs installed. I do. And uh, so my game is not laggy. It doesn't really have to do too much with like the number of packs or even like um, your computer specs to an extent. Like if you have like a moderate computer, then you should be able to run The Sims 3 relatively well because it's an older game. That being said, it's not very optimized, but I do have a video and lots of other people have probably even better videos about things you can do to make it run smoother. The one thing I will say without getting too sidetracked is that there's something called the Lazy Duchess Smooth Patch. That's your first thing to do. You wanna get that and you wanna learn how that works and just install it and use that as, you know, use that to launch your game. The other thing you should do is limit the FPS on your game. So if you have like a graphics card, just go into the settings, go into the FPS of Sims 3 and just put it from unlimited to 60, that's it. And if, and if you have no idea what any of this means, Google and the videos, because everyone just does it step by step with you to show you. So it shouldn't be too difficult. Those aren't super dangerous things to do. Like if you don't install the smooth patch, then you, you just won't be using it. And if in FPS limitation, I think is pretty tame in terms of adjusting things. There was no one like that in YouTube talking about The Sims. Thank you. I, I, at least my toxicity is unique. Okay, let's see, create a cat. Let's create a cat. I don't think I've ever made a pet in the, because I always adopt pets. Like I'm really big on like, just like adopting pets. Like I just wouldn't think to, even in real life, like I wouldn't like, you know, like purchase to breed. It's more like, okay, like what's this cat's life gonna be like if I don't adopt it? So this cat has nothing to do with Kyle. I'm just gonna, can I just hit randomize? I'm gonna hit randomize until I get, okay, this is, this is definitely Kyle's cheek fur. Okay, I don't know what to do. I need a minute. <laughs> Smooth patch is definitely a blessing. Hi, Melly, how are you doing? I still don't know if I say your name right. Okay, so we're gonna make adult pet or elder pet. Kyle is not an elder. Oh, he gets gray fur. That's so cute. Oh my God, okay. So let's, Kyle. Let's name him Kyle Subscribe. <laughs> there we go. Just in case later, because some people like to watch videos on demand later. I don't understand that. Like people have said like, oh, thank you for posting your streams like after because they're kind of automatically posted. I just never thought people would be interested in listening to me talk slowly for three hours. It's only a few people who like that. So I know it's not that popular. Hi nerd, how you doing, fellow nerd? Okay, I need to it, I need to just change this cat to white first. Okay, great. So now I have a better a better start. So Kyle's got like flame pointy stuff. So we'll have to figure that out. He's asleep. Oh my god, he's so cute. Maybe I'll just like rotate. Look, this 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 might be ideal actually. Okay, so that way he can just rest for now, right? Yeah, like I don't mind for background noise. Actually, I will say to now my lighting's messed up, but that's fine. It's not it's not really about me. It's about Kyle, right? Yeah, so um I like I like watching Cindy, like uh like Pleasant Sims streams now because hi toast. Oh my god, thank you for joining. I saw that. I think I put you in one of the videos. So I didn't announce it yet because I had some pre-recorded. So I I couldn't say Hi Toast, thank you for joining yet, but I was do uh, I was gonna do that in what I'm recording this week, which instead of recording, I started streaming, so we'll see. I did a lot of videos over the last two weeks though. I think I think that's enough for people for a little bit. 
You might need to choose main main coon and you're halfway there. Okie doke. There's my light. I am here again. Okay. I'm reading, sorry. <laughs> I watch while writing my notes. I miss I miss her too. I miss her so much. Like it's not even funny. Like she I was in such like a weird headspace for like a year and just she brought me back into like things that I love and like I don't know. Like I don't know how to explain it. Like I just I miss her. I do miss her. But she does do the vlogs and I was so happy to hear about her pregnancy. I think that is that's like a fairy tale. Like the girl who had all the babies in The Sims and all she wanted was a baby of her own. Like it writes itself, you know, like I'm crying. <laughs> oh my God, then you'll see me adopting soon, right? In real life. What I will say though, is that I don't want her to come back and like not want to come back. Like I like, I would love if one day she felt like she wanted to and then chose to do that. That, that would make me happy. What would not make me happy is her feeling that she had to or that she owed people something. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know anything like that. I don't, I don't, yeah, I don't like that. But you know, maybe one day she might be like, you know what? I'm the best simmer in the world because she is like flat out. Like, I mean, I am not like I can. She's iconic in every way, right? She's kind of like she's kind of like Eliza Pancakes, like the late like the late comer who sweeps in and it's like, OK, you're like the top sim now. <laughs> hi, hi, Tiana. How are you doing? OK, so we got some Kyle going on there just forgive my noise for a second. Get everything back in control. OK. Yeah, and I don't think like and she's um she's a very strong minded person. Like I don't um I just don't see her doing something that she doesn't want to do, right? I'm not I'm not I'm not, I'm not worried about that. She'll tell you what she thinks, right? Can we just have a moment to remember her reacting to the to the Batu trailer? That that was a turning point for me. That that was like my straw that broke the camel's back. I was just like, I'm a Sims 4 YouTuber and this is awful. Like, and I was so mad and then that just kind of brought it out of me. And then I'm like, yeah, like why aren't I playing older Sims games? And like, I didn't want to make Sims 2 exclusive content or anything. Cause I also didn't want to like copy her, but I'm like, eh, there's not, there's not a whole lot going on in Sims 3 and what people are doing is so different than what I want to do. So, cause a lot of Sims 3, see the thing is Sims 3 players are so much more cool, calm and collected than I am. They're so like eloquent, intelligent, <laughs> I don't know. And they just, well, I personally believe there were strengths in the Sims 3 and there's me going, the Sims 4 sucks. Like I'm just aggressively doing it. Oh well. Okay, let's let's see what Kyle's face looks like. That too was the straw that woke the llama. I want The Sims 3 to stay alive because I do think it's gonna have the most longevity. Sims 2 maybe as well, right? But I think there's already enough people who do The Sims 2. Ahmed, how could you know you're not intelligent if you're not, right? Because if you are stupid, then you don't want to be, and then you think you're stupid, it means you're probably wrong, so you're smart, right? So it's a paradox. Sims 3 is the best game. It kind of, yeah, like, I just think it's, it's as good as we're going to get ever. It's, there will, let's not even think about Sims 5. Okay, so this is Kyle. So if we can see Kyle's color, See if I can like get him down here. So he's got these like blonde bits. So he's like blonde at the top and like most of his back is too. And he was more white as a baby, but now he's more like kind of, he's kind of like a creamsicle that melted a bit. You know what I mean? Like where the outside is like peachy colored and then the inside's just white ice cream. You're bad at algebra. Okay, I'll tell you this too. From someone who's who's a math person, 
most people are awful at math. I bet most people don't even know fractions. Like, it's so... It's so ubiquitous. It's so common. So don't feel bad about it. It's not a you thing. Most people don't know any... Like, And I'm talking like accountants, people who work at banks. I'm talking like professional people, lawyers, like doctors even. I've known doctors who couldn't solve for X. Like... <laughs> Ah. <laughs> it's just a separate skill. It's just like, it's like a language. It's like, you don't speak Japanese, then you're stupid. It's like, well, if no one taught you Japanese, then how are you supposed to know it, right? Although I do know a lot of Japanese names after the snowy escape patch. When they just renamed all my Sims. <laughs> you like, you like math? Good. You should keep liking it because it's your friend. Math is your friend. You can prove yourself right. That's the best part about math is that it's not guessing and then until you're proven wrong, it's proving yourself right. I just have the one cat right now and there's a dog in the other room, so. He usually doesn't come in though. I love Okay, let's do it. Oh, my tummy. <laughs> He's kicking me. <laughs> Base. Okay, Kyle, we have we have to show you for the video. He just doesn't like to stand up. Like the problem is like if I try to stand him up, he just flops over. Stand up. <laughs> okay, so Kyle's here. So he's got blue blue eyes. Uh, we know his eyes are always kind of smizing. Um, he's got blondish fur, pointy ears, big cheek fur. Oh, okay, he's gone for a little bit. Let's let's paint him while while he's thinking he's getting fed. So I'll pop back up here and we'll get started. Beautiful big baby, I know. Okay, I want to. Oh yeah, advanced mode. We're gonna need advanced mode for this. What are these? <laughs> Regions. I don't know anything about this. Oh my god, I'm already in too deep. <laughs> okay. I gotta find his color too. So he's definitely like a like a creamsicle like that. Okay. So how do I hmm? Okay, no, the base the base layer has to be white. Oh my god. Let me just click around. For, I'm sure some people are watching this screaming because it's like, what are you doing? I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> What's this? Do I have to drag it onto him? Hmm. Why did you do advanced mode? I don't know. I have to kind of do advanced mode though, right? No, I don't want that. I want that there. Why Why can't I do it? Oh good. Okay, we got this. Kind of. Yes. Okay. Okay. I'm on I'm in a good place now, I think. Perfect. The kitty has funny cute face in the game. I know. I have to fix the eyes. Once I once I kind of do the eyes like this and like rotate them, I think it'll give him more of his face because that is kind of like his ears and his cheeks, right? Okay. Can I just drag it? Why can't I just drag it? It's not, it's not clicking. First shape, oh God. Custom coat color, I'm overwhelmed. Okay, I don't want the face. I'm looking at him now. Like, it's mostly his back and his tail and his face. So I should just click. Can I, can I get out of this? Mm. What if I just go over here and then I go back to Kyle? <laughs> Yay, I'm back in the normal thing. Okay, great. What breed is he? Should I just start over? <laughs> Let's see. Maine Coon. Honestly, the other one looked more like Kyle. <laughs> Do the breeds affect anything other than appearance? I 
I need to add a layer. Oh, goodness. I know sometimes like I'll kind of whip out like a for be like a beginner tutorial for something just to give someone all the easy quick things to get started. That's what I could use for this. Like, how do I make my cat my cat without getting overwhelmed? It's this snout. Oh, he has a weird snout. I should change it. No. I'm watching him lick himself now. He doesn't have it like that. Nose color. He has a pink nose. Oh, I can change his nose. That's the cutest part so far. I love it. It's a little less pink than that. I Oh, I want to click advanced mode, but I'm not going to. Okay, let's click eyes. Let's see if I get that. I need him to have more like cat's eyes. Only the traits affect gameplay. Awesome. Yeah, so yeah, so then I won't bother really. Oh my god, you can have one blue eye and one white eye. That's so cute. I'm gonna have to change this color to more of a blue. Cause those are his eyes are way bluer than mine. I'd say maybe like that color. I know, right? His nose isn't right, though. Snout. He's looking at me. <laughs> He's looking. He's just licking himself. He should have done that earlier, actually. Sometimes he's not really... I don't know. Let's see. I did that. His ears, I think the ears are pretty good. Oh, maybe like that. <laughs> I'm thinking definitely not flopped. It's yeah, it's definitely more like this. I don't know. They should be a little bigger, though. I'll look at me. Stop licking. His ears are kind of forward ish, but not like this. No. I think it's this one. You can just go escape back to me. One of those should work. Thank you. Yes, we're making Kyle. Kyle's here. Kyle's, uh, we had him on a couple times already. He's just kind of like cleaning up his feet for some reason. So we're going to let that happen. But I'm trying to, I want to make his head and his ears tips blonde. But we'll, maybe we'll save that to the end. I like that I got his tail and his back already. His, his stomach is white for sure. He doesn't wear a collar or anything. Kyle's microchipped, but I don't have him. But he, he doesn't really go outside. Like, I take him outside sometimes, but... Yeah, that's it. I love Big... He's huge. He's huge. Not, like, no exaggeration. Okay, why don't we just do personality? Oh my god, Piggy! Yep, for sure. Okay, I know I'm giving him Piggy. I've already decided that. Shy. No, not Kyle. Let's see. Okay. Clue. He is. Kyle is not bright. He's not bright. Because the other cat I was living with, she's smart. Like, she could, she'll she learn anything, right? And Kyle, it's like, it took him a year to teach him sit and stuff, right? Yeah, he is kind of like a creamsicle color. That's, I said that earlier, actually. That's so funny. That was, um, that's exactly how I described it. I said he's like a creamsicle that's melting. Hi, Joe. How are you doing? Let's see. Noisy. Oh, my God. Yeah, Kyle screams. Kyle's lazy. <laughs> for sure. Yes, that's Kyle. Yawning, that's Kyle for sure. The party don't start till I walk in. Don't stop, make it rock. <laughs> I, I heard that today. That's actually why that popped in my head. And I thought it was weird that you quoted that. Cool. Okay. Kyle's friendly. Okay, adventurous, no. Aggressive, no. Clueless, maybe. Destructive, no. Friendly, yes. Genius, no. Hunter. Ugh. He wants to be a hunter, but he sucks. Hi, lady. How are you doing? 
Welcome, welcome, everybody. I'm just scrolling up to make sure, like, I didn't miss anything. Like, another, another spam bot or something. Non-destructive? I might just give him that, because he does not, he doesn't ruin anything, really. Playful, proud. Proud pets think they're better than others. <laughs> That's definitely more me. Quiet pets, he's not quiet, he's not shy, he's not skittish. Okay, so I've narrowed it down to friendly and clueless. I don't want piggy, lazy, and clueless, so I'm gonna do piggy, lazy, and friendly. And in fact, because like friendly is just not a trait that I would pick usually, but it does really describe him, right? Like it's, it's really, you know, like I just, I hate making perfect sims. Like, oh, He's a genius who's friendly and this. No, I don't want a cat like that. That's boring, right? I want I want a piggy who's lazy, but friendly. Okay, I have to figure out which, because Kyle has a high pitched squeak. Oh yeah. Oh my God, Kyle, watch this. So Kyle's, so Kyle's there, right? He can hear it. He thinks there's a cat. Oh my god, those are real meows. <laughs> His eyes are like... Like, what's... Like, what is that? Yeah, cats are... Cats are entirely pleasure-driven, right? They're all pleasure sims. And they don't... They don't... Like, they don't hold grudges either. They just... They just move on. I could see them becoming annoying. Absolutely. I could see that. I know, right? Okay. So let's get... Okay, I think that's pretty much it for Kyle. Um. Well, I guess we'll have to make me quickly and create a sim too, right? Draw me like one of your French girls. That's how he lies down though. Oh, now he's licking his bum. <laughs> that's a whole other pose. Okay. Let's see if I can get his head blonde. That would be my that would be my favorite thing to do right now. Okay. Coat. First shape, coat color, tail. That that is definitely his tail. I'm not touching his tail either. Okay, advanced mode. Add a layer. Perfect. Now we're gonna go regions. Oh no, head. Oh no. No. Okay, undo. I love the undo button. No, it's happening again. I'm so sorry. Okay, hide user. Okay. Yay, they deleted. Okay, so yeah, so um if you guys report them and if I if I also um hide them from channel that should be fine can i not do the top of the head does anyone know how to do this okay region i don't know what to do how do i get his is it this way? oh no he's not getting a mustache actually his hmm one of these might be appropriate oh god Oh my god, what have I done? <laughs> Here. Is the music like super loud or something? I'm just I'm just turning it down. I'm gonna err on the side of caution. I think no music is better than too strong of music. Ew, what have I done? I don't know what to do. <laughs> By the way, I'm burping. That's gonna be happening. Guess that's happening. Okay, that's better. Oh, he's so cute. I'm just looking at his face. I haven't touched advanced mode, and I don't know how any of it works. Okay, yeah, me neither. First shape. Oh, cool. Okay. So Kyle def definitely has the puffed on his chest. He definitely has the face. Let's see if I can get... Should I just get a picture of him up here? I don't know. Okay, you can't do the music. Okay. Okay, he has no curliness at all. It's all straight. For density, maximum. <laughs> Ew. Maybe I'll... 
Oh wait, actually no, like, so... His fur is, like... It's very thin furs, but there's a lot of them. Okay. The kiddos are watching story bot. Yeah, okay, that's fine. No, like I was worried because in one stream it was like way, like way too loud, and I, I felt people should have complained, but nobody really. Maybe I didn't see it though either, right? If you can see the pellets in the left window, I believe you can move the pattern that you want to color there. Okay. You can see the pelt in the left window. Okay, left is the other side, so I'm not looking at the right thing. So let's see. Escape, somebody said works, backspace. Neither of those gets out of this, okay. <laughs> this, this game, okay, great. We're back in here. Pelt the left window. Okay, this thing, the pelt in the left window, you can move the pattern that you want. <gasps> Thank you. I see, thank, that's exactly what I needed. Phoenix, Phoenix, Val Games, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, you did it. Oh my God, that's exactly what I need. Oh God. Oh, I can make it smaller, oh my God, yes. Okay, this is exactly what I wanted. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Yes, perfect, done. Drag that there, opacity down, great. I'm gonna add another one too, why not? Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. 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 Yes. 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 That's exactly it. Okay. See, like the back of his head, he's got like the blonde on the back of the ears, and on the front, he doesn't. And like it kind of goes down to his face. So this is exactly what I was looking for. Oh my god. I can make it like longer one way and not the other. Ah. Oh, this is awesome. This is the best. I feel like. I can make pets now. I learned something. That's so good. See, this is the other thing too. Like, there's not there's not a whole lot of videos on The Sims 3. So, like, because like with The Sims 4, if you want to do anything, you just have to Google it. Because there's like 25,000 videos about it. But with The Sims 3, it's like, how do I do this very specific niche thing? And like nobody has any idea. That's why I like playing The Sims 3 together. And especially with like comments and stuff too, because it's just like no one person knows everything about The Sims 3. There's too much, right? So you kind of have to bounce things off of each other, right? Like, I know it's Sims 3. Hi, hi, headache. I hope I'm not giving you a headache. Okay, so Kyle is basically done. I want to just fix up his face a little bit too. Because now I know what I'm doing. So I'm like, okay, great. Uh, Coat. Advanced mode. Held done. I just want to move this back a little bit. There we go. Perfecto. I want to get like a little bit. No, oh, I didn't mean to do that. Who's that? Yeah, this is awesome. Okie doke. Let's try and just make. I'm going to try and make me in like three seconds. So I'm just going to go to the pre made sim, I guess. I'm going to find the one that looks the closest like me. And then we're just going to fix his personality to be mean. And that'll pretty much be it. Oh my god, horses. I'm not making a horse right now. I was overwhelmed with making my own cat. How will I do it? You have to see how he's sleeping. He doesn't, like, he doesn't respond. He's so late. See? He's not even opening his eyes. Like, he's just, uh. He would scare a lot of vets because he doesn't really do response checks very well. He's breathing. He's just actually I can hear him breathing sometimes. It's like to sim or pet. No. Hurry up. Okay. Male. I wish it would just let me pick which ones I wanted it to load before it loads all of them. That would be a really good thing that the game could have. Honestly, maybe this guy if I fix him up. Oh, he's too skinny though. Close enough. Honestly, I think that's as close as I'm gonna get. I'm just gonna style him differently. This is Rikowski subscribe. 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 Perfect. Yep. Lightest skin tone, probably. I'm a little I don't really have muscles. 
Yeah, it looks right. And then everyone always slides down. <laughs> you always slide a little lower than than kind of what you actually are. I don't know. I've always done that. Ooh. Ooh, I like this. I don't like it in purple, but my hair's not that light. Realistically, my hair is more muted than this. Yeah, this is this is definitely more my more my style. It just needs to have less orange in it, you know. Yeah, that's better. I do have an earring. I don't have two though. Yeah, I kind of like him too. Like he's kind of like a good a good default. I do not have that strong of a chin. <laughs> We're gonna have to fix that too. I can't grow facial hair, so I shouldn't even bother with that. I'm not changing his whole face. I'm getting better at create a sim. Yeah, def there we go. I don't have a big chin at all. I have like a little micro chin. Somebody said that to me. He's like, you have a weak chin. And I was like, good. I don't care. <laughs> oh no, my chin doesn't fit your societal beauty standards. Like, screw you. Which one do you prefer? Be able to control your pets like The Sims 3? So you can control them in The Sims 4, you just need a quick mod. They actually coded it into it, so I'll mention that if you enjoy playing with them. I have no interest in controlling my pets. Unless there's like fun stuff for them to do and it's The Sims 3, so there probably is. Let's just say I'm glad you can't control them in The Sims 4. It's just too, it's just too, like, frustrating. It's, like, it's too much to do. I can barely remember to feed them, so I don't know if I'm going to be able to, you know what I mean? So am I going to be able to, um, have time to control them? Sandpaper is a good, that's, that's, that's my hair color, sandpaper. It's so hard to tell my actual hair color because the way lighting works. Let me see if I can get some, like, light on my hair. Oh God, it looks green. Okay, so honestly, that's not... Ignore camera as to what my hair color looks like. This is definitely more like a, like, like, like an ashy blonde. More ashy as I get older. Okay, I would, I would probably wear a leather jacket. I would probably not, I would... Me at 20 would wear a leather jacket and sunglasses, actually. I was that bodacious, for sure. I don't mind the earrings. I'm just going to take out one of them. Ew. Ugh, this is worse. Oh my god, now I have to change his eyebrows quickly. This is so frustrating. So weeb. And then yeah, because I want to I want to actually jump in and see how Kyle behaves in the game and then we'll renovate some houses. Maybe we'll renovate one of the starters for Kyle and I and we'll start with that because I do want to fix up Sunset Valley. That's like on my to-do list anyway. So I thought, okay, we'll play with Kyle. We'll pet Kyle. We'll make him in the Sims. Then we'll fix some of the ugliness. Eyes. My eyes are like a grayish blue. They're not that, see, they're not that blue and they're not that gray. So unfortunately I'll have to go into creative style. My eyes aren't that light either. Yeah, definitely like that. I have big eyes though, that's the pro not that big. I spoke too soon. <laughs> oh my god, that's awful. Okay, I'm just gonna click no. No wonder people hate the Sims 3 create a sim. Like the defaults are hideous. Like this is none of these look normal. None of these. You know what I mean? Like you but if you do have the patience, you can actually go in and fix it. No, there we go. Where's just like the scale? Okay, great. Can I put them closer together? I do not have a, actually my eyebrows are kind of boring like that. I don't do anything to my eyebrows. They're just kind of the way they are. 
yeah alien eye modifier that's exactly what i mean like it's like i'm not really picky when it comes to like human aesthetic like to me as long as it's in that realm like if i can believe it's a person but then sometimes yeah like it'll just be like what is that i do kind of i do because the thing see the thing is i have i have i have no jaw right so since i don't have a jaw everything just cop like pops pops down so i need to i bet if i fix the jaw that'll make the cheeks look smaller too. They used to tell me when I was 18, like, oh, well, when you get a little older, then your face will fill out. It never happened. It never happened. Never use the defaults. Yeah, no, of course not. I can't. Honestly, you're better off just adopting in The Sims 3 and just hope for the best. Oh, the jaw's already down. Oh, no. There we go. Yes, like this. But I don't have no chin. There we go. That's kind of my nose, right? No, my nose is bigger than that. But I don't have that bulb. Oh god. Oh my god, it's getting worse. You know what? Let's just let's just go with that. <laughs> let's make it a little bigger nose what i don't i have a thin nose but it sticks out far which part is that forget it i'm not i'm not working on the nose oh my god his eyelashes this is so bad i'm so bad at create a sim i was i was supposed to make a cat i was that that is it i just don't want kyle living with anyone other than me oh my god eyelid height like <laughs> god he's ugly I should have titled this stream making making myself ugly. Why does that look so bright? Okay, no eyelashes. That's going to be much better. Thank God. Okay, darker eyebrows, no eyelashes. Thank you. Cuz my eyelashes are like really blonde. Like my my head hair is kind of dirty blonde, but like the the like the the hair on my body, that's like platinum, so you can't even see it. So like, I don't have eyelashes or like arm hair or anything like that. Twink for life. And honestly, it's overall advantageous, so I don't mind. I save a fortune on shaving. A fortune. I shave like once a, like once a week, maybe. My face. These eyes. Oh god, there's even worse eyes. You know what? I'm just going to pick those and I'm just going to rotate them a little bit. And I scale a little smaller. Honestly, he's ugly though. Okay, I don't care. I'm fine with it. They're always better looking in game and in fact, if I'm if <sighs> If I'm getting stuck on create a sim, look at the mirror. So I don't, I don't have create a sim tips, but oh, it's the mouth that's wrong. Okay, I'll fix it. But like, if you look in the mirror, that's how they look in the game. So if it looks weird from like the first part, I just rotate their face to the mirror because light's going to be hitting because light is the most important thing, right? Like that's what you're seeing is light, right? So if it hits the face in different ways, then it'll be like more indicative as to what you're going to see. So it's definitely the mouth that's throwing me off. Because I didn't even touch the mouth. I don't I don't have lips, do I? Not really. I have more of a bottom lip. I don't really have a top lip. I think that's a British thing. I kind of have a big mouth though. I kind of have a big, yeah, like I have. I have big eyes and big mouth. Okay, now let's just give myself. Um, I just don't like the necklace with it. I wouldn't. I wouldn't wear um, a choker. That's absolutely not something I would wear. I can load all my clothes. Let's just put me in an old man cardigan because that's really what's happening. 
I'm like, ew, would I wear any of these? And I'm like, maybe in 2010. And I'm like, oh, that's when the packs came out. Oh, God. This bitch is back. See you. Bye bye. Dustin's here, finally. Ugh, I've been waiting. Okay. You're gonna get rid of Max's smile. I had a cat in the game find a plasma bug. 2,000 simoleons. Well, we'll be doing that then. Hi, hi, L. Suji, Sugi. That means something in a different language. Uh. Okay, let's just, I'll just, I'm honestly just gonna click the first thing that I can see that I would wear. And ironically, I'm gonna go into, um, into the future. Ew. Oh wait, this werewolves, that makes sense. Austin Powers, lifeguards, old men, bowling shirts. <laughs> the creative sim is weak. Like I'll say that. Like the actual um, the actual objects I would say in The Sims Three are a little weak. There's a lot of them, but then again, they even though some of them are quite ugly, you can customize them. Thank you so much. Yeah, I tried to delete some. I would wear this. I would absolutely wear something like this. I'm just going to change my color, my pants to a funky color. I kind of just wear basic jeans. I make a lot of my own jeans, so I don't have like crazy styles or anything. I don't have time for that. But I'll but I'll buy like a fancy denim and stuff nowadays. I know, I just don't have very much CC. I just want a good color for G. I want, I want a good blue, but I can't find it. That's fine. Black shoes sounds good. Oh God, I'm hideous. Okay, that's it. He started playing The Sims 3 for the first time in ages this week after downloading the speed up mod you recommended. The load bars are smooth as butter now, isn't it? Isn't it just so good to just see it? <laughs> It's just slide, right? It's just like going down a water slide. It's just like, whew, right? It still takes a minute, but at least it's a smooth, smooth uh, process. You can clone plasma bugs in Sims 3 Uni and have unlimited money. You always have tricks. Like all of you guys always have like some, like some trick with something else. I love it. Okay, what are my traits? Definitely evil. Coward. I'm an evil coward genius who hates the outdoors and is a vegetarian. <laughs> let's not, let's not comment on that at all. Let's see. Okay. Uh, sorry, I have to read and then it like throws me right off. Okay, I'm definitely perceptive. I'm gonna I'm gonna keep that. Wait, what does it do? Oh, investigators. Maybe I'll drop. Let's see here. Floyd, I have no idea what you said in any of your messages. <laughs> I'm sorry. I tried. Okay, let's see. Um, vegetarian, yes. Uh, unflirty, yes. I'm a bit snobbish. Like, I'm you like, I've never I've never been rich, but I've certainly fooled a lot of people into thinking I was for a long time. <laughs> it's fun. My cat, oh yeah, he's here. We're uh, we're bringing him back. He just uh, he just had a rest. He's sleeping again, but we'll but uh, we'll pull him back in because we made him in The Sims. But the problem is that we have to make me too, and that's kind of what sidetracked me. I'm unflirty. I am frugal. I am mean spirited. I think that's fine. I think two positives or three positives, two negatives. It's a good recipe. Okie doke.
Ugly Melon. I love it. What a great name. I say we should embrace the word ugly because everything's ugly, really, if you think about it. Everything's awful. Let's just laugh at it. Over emotional? Not really. Neurotic. It's I am neat. I'm very neat. I'll just pick that one. Sometimes I just like to pick different versions because like I think realistically maybe 10 to 15 of these traits are appropriate for me. So when I make a new sim self, I just like to kind of pick the first five I see. So today I am a frugal, mean spirited, neat, unflirty vegetarian. That's absolutely it. Your mom came up with it. Well, well done. Love it. Gold digger. Oh my God. I would definitely marry a rich person. I just would never marry them for their money. It's not an it's not a plus for me though. Like I don't know. I would rather be the rich one. An ugly melon head. Well, I mean, if you were a baby, absolutely, right? Like babies' heads are like this. <laughs> okay, what's my favorite color? I do like red. I like turquoise. It knew my color too, because like I, uh, I would say turquoise or red from these colors. Unless uh, there's not, there's not really a fuchsia. I like fuchsia and I like teal, Irish green. Blech. Pop for sure. Pop music. What would be my favorite food out of here? I, uh, I don't even like veggie burgers, honestly. I am vegetarian. I haven't eaten meat in like 10 ish years. <laughs> Cher. I love Cher. Cher's awesome. Honey, I am a rich man. <clears throat> I love Cher. I used to sing Cher when I was two years old. Like, if I go down back down, burning. Like, all that. I used to plug a microphone into an amp and just sing it. Two. I'd wrap a blanket around me like it was a dress. Like, I don't know. I was just always weird. I love pumpkin pie. I'm going to pick that pumpkin pie. I could eat pumpkin pie every day. I'm a Leo too. How did it know that? It literally... See, the weird thing is that I deleted like lots of my social medias and stuff recently. So now I feel like they're trying to like show like we, we know everything about you still. Uh, just me being paranoid again. Okay. Rikowski subscribe. I spelled subscribe wrong again. Subscribe. Got it. Okay. Oh, friendly reminder. Everyone like the stream. I didn't say that yet. Oh my goodness. Please like the stream. It really, it really helps kind of give me that extra kick, right? And kind of like every time we do this, we get like a few new people too, right? So it's nice to just kind of expand it out. Okay. The ugliest version of me is ready to go, and the beautifulest version of Kyle. Oh, I didn't pick my lifetime thing. Sure, gold digger. Why not? That is definitely how I would play The Sims, so that's fine. Baby big head, why not? I don't know. I just think the best thing you can do is just to kind of like go with it, right? So it's like, she says my head's big and ugly. I'm like, embrace it then. You, you and your big ugly head, go have a fabulous day. It's fine. Renee, we have so much in common. Look at that. 10 plus years, Leo vegetarian. Okay. Which starter house is the ugliest? I'm going to grab Kyle. We're going to have like a little bit of a break too. Just uh, before we get started. Because now I have this in a good place. So let's see. I'm just going to like. Okay, I'm back here because now we can do some Kyle petting so it's not like completely clickbaity. I didn't mean to clickbait. I did a little bit, but. It's my two year anniversary. Happy two years on YouTube. Oh, my God. Two years ago today, I made the worst video in the history of Sims content. And look at me now making the worst stream. No. <laughs> I want to play in Monte Vista, but I want to f see the thing is, is that I've been promising people that I'm going to start really fixing Sunset Valley because when I did the mansion. So, by the way, my land grab mansion is available on the Sims 3 exchange 
and it should just be base game. So if you have a working copy of the sim, where is it? I'm lost. Yeah, so then the mansion here, I have it up on the exchange because a few people asked for it. It's It should be base game. It'll say there's some store items in it. It's not important. It's like one lamp and like one chair and stuff. Like you won't even notice because there's so much crap in this house anyway. So don't worry about that. It's just it's just a base game mansion. So and it doesn't have to be for the land grabs. It's kind of generic too. So you could pop it like up here and then you could have like a third rich family who's like screwing with both other families. I don't know. Honky doke. Let's see. Oh, I'm, oh, I, you can't even see because I have my face. I'm so sorry. I'm so stupid. Okay, Kyle, let's go. Kai. Sims break. My there is fur all over my desk now. And I just cleaned up. Silly me, what was I thinking? Wah. What are you doing, Kyle? Mm. Mm. Big fluffy boy, I know. The Frio's house? Frio. Is that is that which family I forget again oh my god I always mix all these people up uh I'm always <laughs> I hate when I mix it up and then I'm like 10 minutes into talking about it you could squeeze him yes you could for the low low price of this up no I will stop this bot right off the bat I see you see you can you tell I'm unflirty I'm like Sex dates? No, not allowed here. <laughs> yeah, he's belly fluff for sure. He's as big as me. <laughs> Why? I have the biggest cat. Like he's 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 going further than than my knees go. I don't know what to say. Look at his face. Winking at you. Yeah, he's he's usually pretty happy. Connor and Jared, that's it. Connor Frio. Connor Frio is who I'm thinking of. Okay, yes, absolutely. Chubby cat ASMR. Yeah, I'm not an ASMR type. Oh, look at all the fur on my back. Can you see that? <laughs> I'm covered. <laughs> I vacuumed yesterday. Like, I don't know what to do. Oh my God. He is so passive. Yeah. So I'm the alpha. Kyle does everything. I, I don't even tell him to do anything. Like I just pick him up and I put him somewhere and I like just push him a bit. Like, and then he just stays there. He just stays. So it's great. So if I just kind of firmly hold him, he's fine. He just, he just, he likes to be touched. That's his like biggest thing. Yeah, I know he's he's still uh, he still has about actually he probably shouldn't grow anymore. I think he's about to turn four. Once he turns four, he stops growing. OK, someone said an ugly house. Let me see one second. Anyone who has a pet is covered in fur. It's part of the thing, too. Right. And like sometimes people like I'm pretty neurotic right? and things do bother me. But like with a cat, like what am I supposed to do? Be like, oh. He's shedding again. Like, he's a cat. Like, what am I supposed to... There's nothing I can do about it. I just can clean up. That's it. 
And if I didn't want to clean up, why do I have a cat, right? That's my fault. Okay, I'm gonna move me into the monotone, which is my favorite starter house in this world. It's not great, but it's certainly the best. So I was watching actually um, three three YouTubers were streaming together, um, but the one I found them through. So as Mara, you may recognize her. She's actually prob probably my favorite YouTuber, I'd say. Uh, so she was streaming The Sims 3 with two friends, and they all and they were all playing Sunset Valley. Not together, but separately, but together, and they all moved into the same starter home, and I and it uh, and it was the monotone, and we're all just like, yeah, this, this is the one. So yeah, we were basically just like, yeah, this is like the, this is like the only good house in the world. Oh, it's expensive too. Low in price. <laughs> oh yeah, showing screen. Okay, I'll come back. I still have to go to the washroom too. <laughs> we'll have we'll have to do that. Yeah, so the monotone is definitely... Yeah, you love it too? Absolutely. I just thought it was funny because none of them are, like, as far... Like, from what I can tell from their content, like, they're builders too, right? But they're not, but they're not like me, like, complaining nonstop, right? It was just funny just to see three simmers just, like, instinctively move into the least ugly thing in the whole house. Asmara's documentary on The Sims is... Amazing. 10 out of 10. Actually, everything she does is amazing. Every video essay that she does, it doesn't really matter what the topic is. I just find I learn so, so much because she has such... I feel like when Asmara is speaking in like a researched way, because she definitely does her re more research than I do, it's like she's grabbing your hand firmly and like, but leading you on a good journey, right? So she's like... Here's the deal, right? And she just lays out all this information in a very digestible and eloquent way. Yes. Just continue. The best starter house ever. Yeah, absolutely. I don't I don't know if it's the best in the game, but it's certainly the best in Sunset Valley. There is no Gianna. Ciao, I think. Oh my god, why is he so ugly? He kind of looks real though, right? Like he looks because real people look like this. Okay, so that is exactly Kyle. Look at this, Kyle. Oh my god. He's like eh, just lying on the ground. Okay, I'm just gonna have us move in. I have to grab Kyle a few things though, right? So Go down to pet. Sometimes I forget to do this right off the bat. I'm gonna give him a scratching po- I have 520 simoleons, oh my god. Okay, so he's gonna get the cheapo chow bowl. Uh, he's gonna get, he doesn't need a bed, he sleeps on couches. Kyle does not have a bed in real life, he just sleeps in my bed. He's so big and sleepy, I know, I love it. We can get the, the cheap litter box. I'll put it in the gigantic bathroom. As usual. Ooh, he likes this. The wall thing? Yeah. Uh, yeah, let's put it in the corner, I think. Actually, no, I'll put it in the living room. Give him something to do in here. Okay, the bowl in the kitchen. Litter box here. I just, I like to have one thing for the cat in each room. You know what I mean? Just kind of have it spread out a little bit. You will put a scratching post in here too. Did I put a scratching post already? No, I didn't. So I'll put a scratching post in my room, a toy in the living room, bowl, and you know, and I'm, and I'm definitely replacing the bathroom sink with the kitchen sink. Great. Okay, we're good to go. Litter box, we're ready to go. Fill bowl. <laughs> I need a job already. Oh my god. Okay, great. So now he's not gonna die. Okay, so seriously speaking, this is probably the one house in Sunset Valley that you don't really have to renovate. Other than the fact that it is green, <laughs> it's actually pretty nice. I would say the outside looks the most like a house. And one second, why do so many houses in the game have a table right in front of the sofa? That's very normal in kind of where I live, so I'm not sure. Oh, but, oh, but you mean like right in front? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Like, why is it that close? Like, my coffee table 
like I can't necessarily reach it from the couch, you know, like it's kind of in the middle of the room. So I don't know how to explain it. Okay, let's look at Kyle. Oh my God, it is Kyle. He's looking at me as I'm filling the food. That's definitely Kyle. So let's see if like the sim cat does what Kyle would do. Check out new object. That's that is definitely something Kyle, uh, Kyle would do. He would absolutely anything I bring into the house. I don't do lots of shopping like I'm not I'm not a super big consumer or anything. But if I do like go grocery shopping or like not like not even stuff for him. Right. He's just kind of always next to me and always checking out what I put down. And if I have anyone visit and they bring like a purse, then he just goes in their purse, like sleeps in their purse. I'm petting him. Yay. That's exactly what I would do. Baby. My sweet baby. Look at the pluses. Oh. <laughs> now I know why people go nuts over pet. You know what? <laughs> I may never play with with Sims again. I'll just play with uh like the pet. The coffee table is alligator printed. Yep, you're absolutely right. It sure is. <laughs> Keep in mind, like I said, this is this is the best starter in Sunset Valley, not like ever. Should we fix this one? I don't think so. I think I think we're fine just like moving in. We'll go we'll go fix a different one. Kyle does this too. Let me see. Hmm. Customize pick up pet. It's kind of what I would yeah, go pick him up. These animations are pretty good. That kind of is how I hold him. That's kind of how I carry him. Kyle's staring at the cheap at the cheap pet bull. You're going to die for that. Kyle doesn't care about his pet bull. He just cares if it's full. And I filled it. Pet a held pet. Pet. I love that you can do that. Oh my god, I love it. Okay. Let's see. Customize color and coats. No command to guard house. Kyle's not guarding nothing. Apparently you can have a pet only household. That sounds like fun. What about pets and toddlers? No. <laughs> command to guard. So Kyle can guard things? How does that work? How do I send Kyle to go fetch me things? Well, he's lazy. He probably won't do it. Okay, we got to find the ugliest house. Scary spice every texture in the house. I'm not against that because then it would look like The Sims 1, right? It would be like crazy. We could do a zebra kitchen, a cheetah dining room, a tiger bathroom. <laughs> Carol Baskin's house. Goodness. <laughs> Travel to the future. No, <laughs> I'm not interested today. Kyle in the future. <gasps> Why don't we breed Kyle? Wait, did I make Kyle a girl or a boy? I didn't even check. He's a girl! <laughs> I forgot. It's it's not super important to me, right? He's in the toilet again. Oh my god. Okay, we gotta fix this. Okay, I really have to go for my bathroom break. It's been like an hour and a half. That's pretty good for me. Usually it takes me like an hour to have to go. So maybe I'll just put Kyle like in front of the camera. So that way when people kind of click in, they can be like, oh my god, the cat's playing. I think only dogs can fetch newspaper. See, uh, feed treat. Kyle would like that. Can I stop him from going in the toilet? Oh, does this cost money? I don't think so. Definitely Kyle. Look at that. He's like, how about the house across from the Alvi? Okay, let me go check that out. This one? <laughs> this isn't awful. Is this is this the Alvis? Yeah. So that so that's the Alvis house. Yeah, I would definitely mm, this is like this is like Craftsman McMansion, but shrunk. Oh my god. Yeah, I don't know. It kind of just looks like it's not it's not awful. I'm just trying to think like how would I fix it, right? 
it's just it's just that it's like green and orange and craftsman -y. Federica's here. The other Federica. Oh my god. We have finally everybody here. We have two Federicas, one Federico. I never heard that name until like I started my my YouTube and now <laughs> I see it like every day. Hello, Miss Jenna. You can praise him or scold him. I thought I could scold him, but it didn't show up. Like, I don't see scold reinforcement. Oh, scold for. Okay, got it. Being a piggy. That's that's what I do. I do that in real life. Oh, my God. Mr. XYZ, you're gone. Okay, I found it. Yeah, because I knew I could scold the, like, the Sims 2 pets. because they're Because the first thing that they always do is jump on the counter. Oh, my God. And then he lies down passively. Yep, that's Kyle. Okay, we'll do that. So we'll so we'll pop into a renovation. We'll just have like a quick break. If anyone, okay. So everyone who's watching, don't forget to like the stream. And on top of that, make sure you have some water or something. This I don't buy plastic bottles of water. I bought this on a hot day. I just kind of refill it. So I'm not buying like Seven Eleven water every time I'm thirsty. But it's a great bottle. Like it's the it only costs two dollars, and I'm like. Why would I buy a plastic bottle from the dollar store for two dollars when I'll just use use this for a little bit? I know you're not supposed to use them for too long, but it's fine. Yeah, McMansion-y. Okay, so I'm just gonna have the camera focus on female Kyle. I guess I can go into master controller and change it. Will it just focus on Kyle? Let's see. I guess I'm just gonna keep... I guess my character is just going to keep sitting there with him, right? I wonder if the sexy bots are being sent here because it's a lot lately. Yeah, I don't know. That's fine. Who would have anything against me, right? <laughs> I'm so not controversial. Hi, Robin. Hello, he California. Well, hello. What part of California? That's like... A Maybe the biggest state? No, Texas, I guess, or Alaska. But California is pretty big. <laughs> oh, Madison. Madison Hawk, right? Thorn or something? I don't know. Okay, I'm going to close all those. Okay, so we're going to do a renovation of a house. I that that was a good suggestion, whatever the hell it's called. This 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 orange thing. Why don't we completely change this into like a modern build or something? That would be fun. I'm going to I'm going to completely just rip it apart. <laughs> Maybe. I don't know. I don't think I'm that popular. It's weird because it's been kind of like steady, but it's been recent. So like every week I get like a hundred ish subscribe or something. Right. So it's like it's always going up, but I don't really notice it because it's so gradual. But my streams don't get overpopulated. Like we usually set at about a hundred and we're still at a hundred. That's kind of good. San Francisco Bay Bay Area, so like northern, yeah. So it's probably not st stupid hot there, but probably still warm. And if you're in the San Francisco Bay, then you're around all those um those Queen Anne Victorians that I like. Love those. My dream house is the full house house. <laughs> it's like my dream house. Yeah, we are fixing Sunset Valley. We just got distracted because we made Kyle. We had him, we were petting him, and then I made him in the Sims, and now he just won't stop eating and drinking from the toilet. So Okay, I'm going to put Kyle in the chair just to like entertain everybody while I go to the wash and stuff. So refill your water, like the stream and all that stuff, and we'll be back in just like a minute or so. I always say we'll take a five minute break. Usually I'm gone for just one or two minutes and then I just talk for the rest. Oh, the sun's coming out. The clouds went away. You can see, you can see all my wrinkles now. Excellent. Okay. Okay, let's see. Hi, Xanth. How you doing? Ooh, Orange County. So you're on the opposite side. I like LA. And I like Palm Springs, too. Unpopular opinion. Malibu's overrated. <laughs> No, it isn't. I just couldn't afford that restaurant I wanted to go to. I'm just bitter. Okay, so we're all set. Kyle is in the bathroom in the game, and he's going to be in the chair. 
You live next to Britney Spears? Well, you can't turn off paparazzi with Enros in real life there. Okay, I'm back. Kyle stayed for everybody. Yeah, he just hangs out. How about I keep him in the chair and I will kneel? Because he likes the chair. He's purring. So we have our new setup. <laughs> I'm like back here. Oh my God, the game is still running. I'm still in the bathroom petting Kyle in the game. Yeah, he meows. You have two cats and they are foundlings. Oh, I love cats too. Piggy, come on, spread. Spread them. Take the piggy you are. There we go. He doesn't attack my hand either. Yeah, he just sits there. I don't know. Oh, kind. Itchy ears. His itchy ears. <laughs> he doesn't like kisses, really. He doesn't like his... He doesn't like your face close to his face. Unless you're sleeping and he licks you, that's fine for him. But if you come to him with your face, no, doesn't like that at all. Okay, Kyle, I'm, I'm going to need my seat back. Look at his head. My goodness. Oh, an eyeless cat. Oh, that's so cute uh, in its own way. Love it. I mean, the... <sighs> Some some animals need extra attention in some ways, other ways too, right? So I think every every pet deserves a chance. You have two cats and you feed all the neighborhood feral cats as well. I bet they're all hanging out by your house then. He's so fluffy. Pick, pick me. He sometimes licks me. He usually licks me when he when I when I don't want to. Hi Vioxy, how you doing? You need some serotonin? Well, here's Kyle. That'll help you out. Helping me. Two years. I told you I was gonna be famous, Kyle. He didn't believe me. But in reality, it's all about him, right? <laughs> I was thinking of that. I was like. I'm not, I'm not the type to do like, ooh, I'm going to do like a second channel about like my life or something. I would rather do like something entirely different. So it would be like heading Kyle ASMR. No one, no one even know it's me. Let's put Kyle on there. My wrist will be in it and that'll be it. <laughs> Make sure to subscribe or Kyle won't be happy. 
You have a Himalayan and the fluff is worth the shedding. Absolutely. Okay. Oh, sorry to hear. We've had a lot of people having surgeries late lately. I hope it goes I hope it goes all right for you. It's never fun, that's for sure. I know that. Okay. Oh my god, my sim forgot to eat. I had a big lunch before I started streaming. I'm doing all right. How are you doing? That's the more important question. I have no I have no immediate problems, which is rare. I got a couple, but nothing I can't handle. Okay, I'm gonna get back in my chair. Kyle, you gotta move. Guys, gotta move. I know what'll get him moving. Um, watch me walk towards his food, and then you'll see how he reacts. Okay, now he's eating. Ah. Oh, good. I Yeah, I hope I'm in the same algorithm category as Cindy, because I think that, you know, if if The Sims 4 does another ridiculous pack, somebody's got to say something, right? Instead of, oh, well, we'll see, and it's not for everybody. It's not for anybody sometimes. Who here bought Batu and enjoyed it? I'm curious if anybody did, because I would like someone to explain it to me. I don't understand it. I saw someone defend it a few times, but it was no one who made any points or anything about it. You know what I mean? Okay, I'm going to get my face back small. Ignore the fact I steal that from Shutterstock. And okay, we're back in the... Oh, it's nighttime, though. Okay, I'm just... I'm just going to return to game for a little bit and just speed through until at least the morning. Uh-oh. Okay. <laughs> I thought, oh no, I froze it. Thank you so much. I enjoy making the videos. You have no idea. It's so much fun. When I can get over the anxiety, it's good. <laughs> you bought Batu, used it once and never used it again. Sorry to hear. Okay, so first of all, high school is absolutely going to be the next expansion pack. So let's just kind of get that out of the way. It's essentially confirmed. So, oh, look, she gave birth. I love it. Just Justine Keaton. Now she wants to question her baby, right? Yeah, so, okay, let me see. So the high school pack. So the problem I have is still yet again. I think high school is a good start. I don't think high school is enough for an expansion pack. Number one, right? Like, I just don't see it. I don't get it. And it's like, I do want teens to have more things. And so help me God, there better be things for just teens in the high school. Let's just say that. I hope it, I hope they do it well. I just don't see high school having enough content for an expansion pack. And I don't see The Sims 4 doing it. Like, I, you, you know what I mean? You have that too because you got it in a bundle so very cheap. Oh, that's fine. I like, like, Star Wars is fine. I got no problem with Star Wars. I just have, I just have a big problem with that kind of brand partnership. It just doesn't make any sense. I didn't hate high school. I hated a lot of elementary school. I was very much bullied, but by the time I was 14 or 15, I kind of got this snarky attitude. I remember it was like, some guys like, you're gay. And I was like, so what? You're ugly. Like, you. <laughs> I don't care. And then I just, like, and I literally just stopped caring. I know what I am. I know who I am. I don't care if these losers can see it or not. And in fact, I don't want them to. They're just not worth it. Wow, it looks like nobody liked high school here. That's funny. I'm just looking at the chat. I'm like, oh my god. That too came with some awesome hexagon slate tiles that are cool. I th great, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. I just see the other thing is too is like I would never use Batu in a build because I wouldn't want it showing up on the gallery that Batu was in the build because I wouldn't want anyone. I don't know. It's like it bothers me. But I did like there was a wall I liked from Batu. I remember. 
Yeah, like expansion, like an expansion pack needs to be a whole thing. Like Generations is, first of all, I would say Generations probably has the least content of a Sims 3 expansion pack. And it has, it's got high school, it's got prom, it's got like mood swings, it's got bullying, it's got like different clubs and jobs, it's got uh, elder stuff, it's got strollers, it's got celebrations, family stuff, all the camcorder stuff, like all those things. And they all kind of all life stages right and it kind of brings everything all in together high school sounds like a game pack to me i would have been fine actually with a werewolves like expansion you know i think i think there's more to do with werewolves than i than i would say with high school like i care what people in the gallery think of my builds i guess i just think it's all like the whole purpose of it is to share right and it's like i just i like doing base game plus one pack anyway if i'm building in the sims 4 base game plus one pack or two packs maybe two packs that go together so that way like if somebody owns a certain pack they they're more likely to earn a related pack right like i might do realm of magic and vampires and werewolves in one build right as opposed to like strangerville and parenthood <laughs> and batu you know <laughs> doesn't make any sense unless it was a build challenge High school sounds like something I would just download a mod for, I guess. I don't know. It's just so... What do they have? Two after-school clubs? Like, I don't know. I just don't... The t Teens are just not different enough, right? Because teens wear the same clothes as an adult in The Sims 4, which they don't in other games. Maybe somewhat in The Sims 3, but not in The Sims 2. It's completely separate from what I remember. Okay. We're going to go into Edit Town. I'm going to go into this ugly build, and we'll get started. So cozy craftsman, that's de craftsman was the word I was looking for. Okay, let's go into build buy and fix this. I did not buy werewolves. I've I've had the Sims 4 uninstalled for since since I streamed the Sims 4 and made fun of it, I have not played it. Yeah, I didn't like elementary school. I I was also in the Catholic system too, so that's a little bit um problematic in and of itself. Okay, Cozy Craftsman, I don't want it to be a Cozy Craftsman, but we still have to kind of think about the other houses in the world. Actually, to be f ugh, that one's even uglier, but I think that's owned by somebody. So let's just start off with the essentials. Hi, Prince, how are you doing? They did vampires, then werewolves so far. Yeah. I always confuse teens and young adults in The Sims 4. I have to hover over them. I can't tell the difference. And adults. Oh my god, there's so much fur in my keyboard. I just cleaned it all out too. Why did I clean it before I did this? I want to delete this just to see what it looks like. Hmm. I think my best bet, I want to modern this. I'm going to I'm just going to completely modernize this. Oh, they didn't put a roof there either. Okay, I have to fix this. Give us a second. Flat roof. Start off there. Done. We all agree Sims 4 is just a no-no no matter what DLC is all about. It's just, I just don't see it being fit. Like, I don't... Like, what am I supposed to expect at this point, you know? I don't know what to say. Oh, no. Okay. So I just have, like, a flat basic roof on it now. I'm going to repaint the outside. I'm just going to put it into, like, a stone or something. Let's see what's this ew not what i want i don't i don't know if i want siding i definitely want like a ooh island paradise i think i think i'm sims 4 and uninstalled when the star wars pack came up and it was best decision i ever regret yeah i kind of i don't i would say i regret some of the purchases i think for the time spent in the game it's fine it's just this game has been out for like They've been adding DLC for three years too long. Uh, it should have been done like by now, like they should have just wrapped it up because now like the more they do it, it's just, it's like putting bricks on the back of a dying horse. Like, I just don't understand it. Change the wood paneling to something a little more modern and add a fun color to it. Red is a good idea. I haven't done red in a build for a while. I'm gonna take you up on that. I just wanna find something base game because I like to share these and I don't wanna use like a store object right like this this is from lucky palms or something but i love it let's go to masonry see if we, see if we can find like a flat brick or something hmm. really what i'm looking for 
Rock and stone. See, the things I want are all expansion pack stuff. Ugh, why does that happen? How come the... How come the boring one is? I think it's a DLC for toddlers and DLC for kids. If they're going to add back prom, make teens look back different. Maybe. Yeah, but see, they're not going to. This is like... Whenever like there's like, ooh, a new pack is announced. First of all, shame on each and every one of you who instills false hope in the in the in the community. How dare you? People speculate about ridiculous nonsense that will never happen. And then people get all excited for it and then are promptly disappointed. I think the key to enjoying The Sims 4 is taking it for what it is. Like most of you, if you love it, you're probably a builder. Look at the build by, make your decision that way and take it for what it is. That would be my suggestion. But to like speculate about <laughs> them fixing certain no, like it's not happening. It's absurd. Like it's okay to get excited for certain things, but it's like, I don't know. People are people are just making things up as they go. And this is not about anyone specific. Like I haven't actually watched any Sims 3 con oh, sorry, Sims Sims 4 content in a while. I just remember everyone being like, "Ooh, maybe they'll, you know, like <laughs> ooh, maybe this will be like generations." <laughs> and it's like but it was Snowy Escape and I'm like, "What? No, this thing might be I'll be happy if they make it to the top of the mountain without the game freezing. That'll be like my expectation." Tragically, that was not the case for the first patch. <laughs> but it's fine. Hmm. I'd like tile, but not ugly. Maybe brick. Oh yeah, that's yeah. Like it's just it doesn't it doesn't function properly. And like frankly, I understand that The Sims Three is not is not without its problems, right? But all of its you know like its its strengths and weaknesses are sorted out, kind of thing. Like you can just fix the things that you need to fix, make it run a little bit smoother, and then it's a f better game. I'm just trying things out as I talk. Mm. I'm looking for a specific, specific style. These are so expensive. What is this, $15, $19? What is this? Sims 3 is my baby and I'm sticking to it. I bounce around. Like, I know I'm... I know a lot of people just know me for Sims 3 content at the moment. It's not even my favorite Sims game, like I wouldn't say. I would say Sims 2, maybe even Sims 1. But I mean, I love all three of them and I love them for kind of like different reasons, but they all just have this commonality that I think The Sims 4 is missing. I think The Sims 4 is just a different type of game. Okay, I like this one. Take that, that there. Hurry up, create a style. Oh my God, why is it doing this? Why is the brick like that? What is what is happening? Is this glitched out? What am I what am I changing? Sorry, I don't see. Oh my god, there it is. Cancel. I want the black brick. Yes, from this onto this brick. That's what I want. Yeah, like it's an expectation thing. Like it all like is all like. Ugh. The wedding stories thing, like I saw that coming from a mile away. I was like, there's no, this is not even the same black. Uh, I have to change this too, to more of a beige. There we go. I don't know if I like that even. I'm just trying a few things out. You like The Sims 4 because you didn't buy it. Well done. Well, the rest of us are out a thousand dollars. So that'll be that. <laughs> I'm just kind of looking at the inside. I don't hate this tile, actually. Did I do that? Yes. This is not bad. I don't I don't mind taking the best parts from a build and then kind of bringing them in. Hmm. Just Why is this so off-white at the top. I just don't see why. I feel like Sims 4 is just so empty. It's just, I mean, it's beautiful. It's just superficial. Yeah, it's just nothing, nothing feels right. 
Okay, I have to change the wall. I'm sorry. It's bothering me. I can do. Luckily, I, it's so hard for me to build and chat at the same time, but I don't mind. Maybe we'll just do this one house because I'm kind of lagging behind, but I'll, I'll pick it up a little bit more. That has a baseboard. I don't want a baseboard. Flat wall, that, that is a baseboard too. No, it doesn't. Okay, we're gonna use this then. Oh, this song. Oh my God, the vol, the volume's up so high. I didn't know, I didn't, I didn't notice. Okay, well, we'll listen to it. Cause it's super, cause I have, I have this mod installed where um, it plays the Sims 1 music instead, but it, it kind of, messes with the volume a little bit at times. It'll just play one song randomly louder. So that's kind of what happened here. Okay, I can change this to white and we're good to go. Why is it peach? This is bothering me to no end. I'm gonna make it metal. <laughs> just spice it up a bit. <laughs> what if I made like a metal house? The emotion-based gameplay, I would absolute yes. So as Mara in her documentary, she goes into great detail into the emotions and why it doesn't work. And I agree. Plastic might be good. Let's try a plastic white. Why is it showing up like that? It's driving me nuts. If I change that to black. Ooh, that's all right. I think. What do we think? What does it look like at night? Okay, that's pretty good. It's also in the morning sun, too. Whims, they, they kind of just abandoned the whims, right? Like, I don't know what else to... Yes, I want the black stripe. There we go. Put that there. Okay. So her channel name is just Asmara. I'm just going to put it in here. Oh, my caps lock is on, of course. So I would definitely recommend checking out her Sims documentary. It's in two parts, I believe. The first one is called A Firm Foundation, which is about The Sims 1 and 2 and 3, right? I would pay so much if, if you released it. I wouldn't, because you can fix it yourself in 10 minutes. So... I would just, I would look into it, let's just say, because I really don't experience any, any, uh, any uh, performance issues. This lighting is driving me crazy. I can't believe it's like yellowish. It's driving me nuts. Get some different foundation going on here. Maybe I should change the tile. That'll help too. Why is it all different? I'm, you know what? I'm going to delete this whole balcony too. Kind of get rid of this part. Eh. Am I deleting floors inside? Kind of. Okay, I'm just gonna make it like a smaller balcony here. Wait, I'm gonna delete the garage actually. Figure out something else for the roof there. Yeah, see, it's def, it's def, it's, def, it's definitely the lighting. Okay, give me a, uh, give me a second. It's gonna go into here. I'm going back into the game. I'm just going to fast forward it to like 11 o'clock. Hi, Bex. How are we doing? Yes, CD, I would definitely look into it. Look into it. Yeah, I want to make a plastic house and I want to be able to see the colors properly. And unfortunately, 6 a.m. is not the lighting for that. I also have this 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 lighting mod in and it's a little maybe a little more creative because I've been playing in Aurora Skies. I haven't checked the builds yet, but I've been just playing in my own house and having babies. Yeah, absolutely. Well, that's exactly what happened with the smooth patch, right? And now after the smooth patch, everything just loads like butter. It still might take a little longer, right? Than, um, than like being instant, but it definitely goes a lot faster and it doesn't feel like your computer is chugging along. My GPU fans no longer go into jet mode because I have my FPS limited. Why are you always hungry? Because I don't have groceries, right? Okay, just eat cat food. 
I'm just gonna. Where's the. Where's the phone? I don't have a phone. There it is. Phone. Services. Call for service. I'm just. I'm gonna order a pizza. <laughs> just so I can eat something. There better not be pepperoni on the pizza. Absolutely. Like, I'm not. Like, I'm not. Um. I don't have the disposable income to be giving a bunch of people money, but uh, the people that I have supported in the past and will continue to support are the people who really contribute to the community or to the game and Lazy Duchess is on. Yep, definitely. Definitely worthy of a, of a donation, I would say. Anyone involved with Enros deserves an, like, an award as far as I'm concerned. The smooth patch is just amazing. Like, I just... It makes the because and like and this is the thing like people always say like what kind of computer do you have the game runs so good I'm like no my computer isn't great it's it's literally these modders they fixed everything for me like you just have to do a few things and get and get it all set up where's my pizza I just wanted to show up oh my god Agnes Crumplebottom I use my own life experiences to ensure realism in my work noted Agnes Crumplebottom while talking with a neighbor in between chapters of her new book. <laughs> don't tell anyone though I don't want them to get the wrong impression about how exciting my life really is I prefer to keep it on the down low you know I don't know why I just like to voice act everything okay here comes the pizza am I still okay bills I don't have enough money for the bills they're 95 and I have 90 dollars <laughs> IRL okay there we go accept the pizza let's go I am mean spirited. I am. I am. Ew. Is there pepperoni on it? Okay, no, there's olives. That's all right. I'll take it. Right now, I'm using the one based off of the movie Frozen. Like, I use. I use only um, burnt waffles lighting mods. So I just kind of switch it out. There's going to be a smooth patch 2.0. I'll make a video about it. I'll send all the money her way. Hi guys, don't give me anything. Give it all to Lazy Duchess so she keeps doing this. I'd much rather have her continue than to have a super chat. You know what I mean? Give it to her. Go to her Patreon or whatever it is. Okay, that's in the fridge. Okay, 1021. Now how's the lighting looking? I just want to go over to the house. Where is it? Past. Where am I? Oh, right. I changed it. That's why I can't find it. See, yeah, now it's a lot. Now it's a lot brighter. Okay, let's go into edit town again. And we'll just go back and we'll just kind of hammer out our renovation. I don't know how people do builds live. Like, that's just, it's so hard for me. Okay. Oh, look at that bird. He's like floating <laughs> right in the corner. Oh, I thought I could grab the bird, but it's actually the tree. Okay, let's get this going. I'm just gonna put on white siding just to kind of default it for a little bit. It's still kind of ugly. That's fine. We'll have to deal with it. It's definitely the lighting mod. Smooth patch doesn't work for me as well as it does for you. I have a variety of launches. The best one I found is frame rate reducer. Yeah, so like I um I I I manually reduce my frame rate on the graphics card. So then that way that's already kind of sorted. But you can do it through some of the launchers too. It but it is. It is one of those things where this is an older game and all of our computers are different. So I would say, yeah, just try out a couple and whichever one you find the best results with, it doesn't matter what I say. It doesn't matter what anyone else does. Oh, I don't have any plans with my sim self. I just, I just made my sim self because we ha I wanted to make my cat and I couldn't imagine my cat living with anyone else. Okay, great. So I'm just going to try and get some mod calls around here. Okay, get that there. What if I take this this white and drag it to here? Still the same. I don't know. I have no idea why the floor hits so differently. I'm going to make it black then. You know what? That'll make it better for me. Ooh. Oh, it's from Coarse Stone Siding with Freeze. What pack is that? Maybe I'll do Tile. That might be fun. Ew, not that tile though. 
Should we use Katy Perry sweet treats? <laughs> we probably should at some point. You need to find a good rock. Actually, you know what? The rock would be on the bottom and then the siding would be on the top, right? That just makes more sense. What if we did like this? Once I change the windows, it'll be much better. There we go, that's better. And then we'll make the bricks white, maybe. Maybe we'll make some of them black. So usually what I like to do is I'll just kind of like do all E's, then all D's, then all C's, then all B's. Just so it's like still whitish and gray, but they're mixed up a little bit. And then you can even take this color palette and like maybe you can transfer it to here. Yes, that's better. Okay. I lost everybody. Somebody say something. I think I'm not live anymore. I don't remember. <laughs> Hmm. Should I leave this part here? You know what? We'll give it the benefit of the doubt. I'm just going to delete the ugly columns. This thing is 290s. I agree. Go down. Okay. This should be whiter. There we go. I got it. Okay, guys, we're back in control. I've I feel like I've kind of got I've kind of got the groove back. Katy Perry plastic house. Yeah, I know, right? Okay, this is this is this is already improving. I no longer want the balcony at the front. I'm gonna do the balcony somewhere else. Actually, maybe I should take this tile and still. I could still do like a detail. See, the problem is is that this shape isn't super modern, so it's a little tricky. I might have to, I'm gonna box in. Oh God, I have to pull this out. Oh, let's see. I'm just gonna hide the fireplace as good as I can. Come on. I can't get to the corner I want. There we go. Take that there, get rid of this. This siding here, done. I guess I could just like, Hmm. I like it like this better. Sometimes I just kind of like zoom through certain things because I kind of get my vision and I want to get it down before I before I forget it. Okay, that looks good. I want glass railings. What the hell are these? Why can't I select that? Where's where's my glass fencing? Is this it? Yes. Perfect. Hmm. Okay, we'll get one balcony on the front there. That's fine. And I want to put like another one on the side here. Oh, I didn't see. I'm sorry. Thank you so much. Okay. Um, hide user from channel. Hide user from channel. Hide user from channel. Okay, I did it. Oh my god, the bots. Report the bots. <laughs> I think everyone here has the wherewithal. I hope. Um to not engage with them. You know what I mean? Maybe we'll do white floors. Not there though. Okay, now I don't like the columns there, but I'll do like maybe three here. I think I'm gonna stick this out one more, one more tile. Can I reach it? Mm. I need a, I need like one here. Yes, that's exactly what I need. I just want a diagonal. There we go. I wanted a nice detail. Clo come on, there we go. So if I do it this way now, because then it's kind of got that like angled look that like the Caliente Sims 2 house has a little bit. It just kind of, you know, pops it up a little bit. I'm still not sold on the wall, but it's fine. Maybe once I put a fence around here too, it'll look better. Actually, what the hell is this thing even doing here? I don't want this. There we go. Oh, thank God, it's less ugly now. Kind of. Maybe this way? 
Just delete this one. Just trying to play around with it a little bit. I don't like these stairs at all. Oh, into the future stairs are probably the best. But one thing you can do, so like I always cheat my stairs. So see, I'll use these, I'll use these crappy stairs and then I'll just go into create a style and then I'll just go into like metals or something, figure it out. Metals. Ooh, shiny. It's reflecting uh, the, the sky. That's too shiny. That's fine. Oh, thank you. I'm just guessing as I go. And then I can take, I'm going to delete these stairs. Take, copy these ones and change the stair width, I guess. You know what? I only need it to be one stair width. I'll do that. Okay, we need to change all of the windows now, though. Oh, thank you. Yeah, he's asleep now. We were playing with him earlier because we made him in create a sim and stuff. So if you really want to get a close up of Kyle, like I'm going to I'm going to end the stream with Kyle too uh, later on. Oh, thank you so much. I stole it from EA. This is this is a reno. This is this is gorgeous, though. I will say when they put effort into their like landscaping and stuff like this is just stunning, you know, they're really good at some things. They're just not good at everything. My favorite thing about complaining about the Sims three houses is that it's so trivial, right? Because when I complain about a Sims four thing, like it hurts me, right? <laughs> but with but with these, I can just kind of laugh at it and have fun. I can't wait to do the inside of this house. Usually I just like doing shells. I know a lot of people, they say that they prefer um, doing interior decorating stuff. I don't. I much prefer doing architecture and shells and stuff. And, uh, so for me to be excited to do the inside, that's kind of rare. So I'm excited for that. Let's see. Which windows do I want to use? I want to use non-ugly windows. So let's see. I'm going to try and keep it base game. So when I put it on the exchange, it's more accessible. None of these are base game. Let's see. There we go. Oh, it includes all the store items, of course. Like this. I love these windows. They're from the Lucky Simoleons Casino. <laughs> I also love the um the all the art deco ones. Hmm. I need I need another detail. I need another detail about this just give me a second somebody said red earlier and I really I really want to do that I'm just putting down like a prototype it's not going to be this this red but I just wanted like a different you know what we don't even need a fireplace as far as I'm concerned let's delete that What do we think? Like just like a little, a little something. Can I make it a pink red? I just find like the shell the most fulfilling. Like I never furnish a room and then think, wow, I did really well. Like I always think, wow, that's pretty. I like it. But with a shell once in a while, I'll build something and I'll just take a step back and go, my God. Goodness, I'm brilliant. You know what I mean? Like, you just kind of get that. It gives me more dopamine, let's say. Oh, thank you so much, doll. Okay, my my biggest advice is, first of all, I'm not a great builder. I've tricked everyone into thinking I'm a great builder. But that's besides the point. What you really have to do is just practice and guess. Like, it's what... What most people have a problem with, I find, is that they get stuck. They're like, I don't know what to do. You could just put the fireplace there instead. Yeah, I was thinking that too. I want to wait till I get to the inside though, because this is where the kitchen is. So I have to kind of rearrange things, I think. Ooh, ooh. San Myshuno, move out of the way. I got this brick. Should I just do it like this? You can split apart some of the wallpaper, and make it look more cohesive. I don't, I don't disagree with that. Actually, let's see. 
Hmm. Let me just think of the best way to do this. If I do it here, I have an idea because sometimes with modern builds, you don't have to repaint a wall. You just have to change it into a window. So like, what if I did something like this? Just kind of spiced it up a little bit. I'll delete, I'll delete the walls inside like this. Give me a second. If it's if it's not clear what I'm doing, it will it will be in a mere moment. Like this. See? Ah, it's getting choppy. If your game starts getting choppy after you use create a style and stuff, you wanna like um just go into build mode and buy mode like F2 and F3 and just swap a couple times or just once, it'll just fix it right up. Okay, we need new doors. That's fine with me. I'll put another door over here. Actually, I don't hate here. Going to here, get rid of this. I want to do a second. Yeah, I'm going to try more bump out stuff. I'm also, yeah, I think this diagonal detail is good enough. The other thing I could do is I could just put like a phrase on top too, right? Like here, give me a second. What if I got rid of that? I do want to use the brick again. I'm going to kind of integrate it back. But the, uh, there's a nice cheat here. Place freezes on. I think that does it. Now what that allows me to do is put a foundation on the roof. See? Beautiful. Like this. How's that looking? So it looks a little bit more modern and chunky now. See? I don't hate it. It's a little dark now, actually, now that I think about it. I'm gonna try and gray this up a little bit. We're gonna do like sixes for the hex code. That's kind of good. Actually, maybe the gray should just be for accents. At least now I have a separate color. So we got something good going on here. I'm gonna also, yeah, so I'm just gonna put some other details, like I do, hmm. Oh, I need, I need another. So you also have to turn off. So place freezes off and then go in and out of build mode just to reset it or else it's gonna, yeah, or else it'll cause problems because then it'll wanna put foundations above ground level because I wanted to, to make that roof, but I don't want to now. Like I don't, like I don't want it to continue, right? So now I'm gonna go down to the very ground level. I'm gonna add foundations. What do you mean can't level terrain? What is happening? Fine, don't work then. See if I care. Where's the terrain? I'm so bad at terrain stuff. That would be my weakness. Okay. Great, so that should be level, you'd think? Why not? Okay, oh, it's because it's level from like over here. Okay, because like I didn't build this house. Oh yeah, constrained floor elevation is great for details, but this cheat is specifically for a freezed roof. Like, so you don't have to use constrained floor elevation for like the style of roof, but for those other things, yes. If you want your garage to touch the ground, yes. Like things like that. Yeah, I use I use CFE for like for like other things. I won't you do this. Yes, I did it. I got it. Oh, I'm so happy. <laughs> okay, so now I can delete some of them. This is all I wanted. I just wanted the frame around here. Because now what I like to do is I like to just kind of put um, some walls like this. Oop, oop. Done. And now I have like a chunky little detail. And you can make these stone instead just to break it up. Maybe I'll make the roof stone too. Ooh. Ooh, I like it. I'm happy. Do you know how to make curved pools? I I know functionally how to. Can I make a pretty one? I don't know, <laughs> right? We'll have to see. Let me do something like this. How are we looking for like a house? <laughs> I 
Maybe that's a little too much here. Hmm. I do want to use the brick though at some point too. Yeah, because we wanna we wanna we wanna break it up a little. I don't like those colors, but I really want to use the red. Someone was recommending red, so. It'll be like university, which is my least favorite pack. Oh my god. Yeah, I would say mine too, personally. I don't think it's bad. I just think it's just not for me. Ooh. I'm gonna go pink again, because that's just my default. Here, I'll go on the edge of pink. I don't know, now it kind of looks like a school. <laughs> what if I made more of it black and I just changed these to stone? I'm just playing around some, cause like I've kind of decided that I like this black siding and I like this and I like this stone wall, but I'm more just copying and pasting just to kind of see if I find something else I like better. Yeah, you're seeing the vision. I'm so, like, it's so, it's so hard for me to articulate what I'm thinking. I'm just kind of running with it and seeing what happens because that's how I make my most beautiful things. I find if I'm just, if I'm just going, going with the wind, so to speak, just deleting this, adding this, changing this. I just use the eyedropper. My finger is always over the E key. So I can just take this wall, change it here. Oh, undo. Like I'm always using the hot keys just to quickly mess around with things. Okay, I need I need a good window. I need a good window. Ooh. Maybe this window. Oh, I can't center it there. I center it here. Maybe I'll do this. I stick this. That's kind of modern-y. Oh my god, the tree. I'm just going to change all of these to white. Drag and drop. Great. Yeah, I, uh, it was it, it it was a craftsman disaster, so we're turning it into modern. What I would like to do is save. So I'm just gonna go back into Edit Town quickly and just save it quickly, so that way we don't um we don't we don't lose our progress. Because now I've got something I like, right? Before, like 15, 20 minutes ago, if like if if it crashed, I'd be like, good, we can restart. I know, me too, Natalie. So like my gallery on The Sims Four is like two downloads or like hundreds. Like it, like there was no in between and I've, oh, it's so, it's so tricky. But I will say if, if you want people to download your house, make sure your thumbnail is perfect. It doesn't matter if your furnishing sucks or if you made some bad choices. If your thumbnail looks good, people will download it. So make sure you're on a good lot with good lighting. If you're in live mode, not not the buy mode, like you have to have a sim moved into the house, you can make uh, the lighting is usually better on the lots and you can fix it up a little bit better. So that would be my, if you want downloads, move a sim into Newcrest and find out which lot the sun hits. TS95, finally. This is like a weekday afternoon, so this is a weird time for me to be streaming. So my goal was to kind of make sure I'm streaming at like different times and figure, you know, just to make myself a little more accessible. Instead of being consistent with the same people, I'd rather just kind of spread it out and reach and reach different people. Okay, let's let's wrap up this shell. I think the shell is almost done. Make that a nice bay window area. I can add windows later as I go, I think. But I think that's pretty good for the shell. Maybe I'll just tile up the driveway. Should I? Uh, I don't know how I feel about this wall part now. I think it needs it though. It needs something. Hmm. Now I wish I was going to use constrained floor elevation, but I'm. I don't want to destroy everything. How do I rotate? What do you mean rotate? Like, um, just like in Sims 4, you just hold Alt. You just jiggle. Jiggle, jiggle. <laughs> oh, thank you. It, it was actually kind of closer to this house. I remember this house. This is called Plus Plus. Oh my God, it's awful. It's just as bad as the one that we're fixing. Maybe we'll just modernize the landscaping a little bit. I think it's a little too organic for a modern build. 
move that back. Maybe just move it here. Okay. Great. I need some terrain paint. Uh, dirt. Dirt and sand. There we go. Dark dirt. Actually, what we should do is just like square it off. Why don't we grab that fence? I don't I don't usually do this, but I know it's I know it's popular. Okay. I'm just gonna make like a little garden. You do little trees too. I may not specifically use these bushes. Like sometimes at the end I'll kind of change it up a little bit. But for now, I think this is like perfect. I'm going to paint that. Usually for terrain paint, um, I usually say do it like really haphazardly and organically. However, I would say when you're doing a modern one like this, like very, very grid like, you can be more careful with it. You can also erase the edges too. So if I go like this, I can always do this. Delete it. Actually, I'm going to delete. I'm going to delete theirs at the front. The back can kind of stay, I think. Where's is this it? Hidden Springs grass. Blue grass. That looks all right. I'm just checking it out. I'm checking out my options. Hidden Springs grass is kind of pretty. Ew, I don't want these here. Delete, 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 Delita. I think there was a girl named Delita. I remember a girl named Delita. Britain's next top model, Delita. <laughs> and my friend was like, delete her. I'm like, that's mean. <laughs> it was funny though. Will I review custom worlds? Probably not. I'll play in custom worlds. I don't, I'm, I don't think it's appropriate for me to review one though. Based on my style, I don't think it's very nice. Ugh, it's ugly. This is awful. Why did you spend six months of your life doing this? Ugh, it's terrible. My god, hurts my eyes. Three out of ten. You know, like, what? people people will cry. <laughs> Maybe. But who cares what I think? Okay, let's look at this floor plan. I don't like anything that I'm seeing inside, to be honest. I think the inside is way worse than I imagined. Okay, I, I, I kind of like the stone floor, so I'll just kind of change everything to this for now. I'm probably not going to have stone in every room, but I just want to keep it. Ugh. I'm also going to change the walls to white, just to have a nice base coat. That's kind of the first thing I do. I just go in and I'm like, see ya, <laughs> get rid of everything that they chose. See, it's already better. The best looking house in Sunset Valley could it might it might be the Altos. It's either the Altos or the Goths, I would say. I think the land grab mansion is hideous. I don't understand it. Oh, this needs to be a glass door. We're not gonna do a glass door for the bathroom though, because I've done that before. Sorry. Oh no, I went in to create a style. Why does this house need two bathrooms? Oh, I guess it's like a half bathroom is fine. Realistically, what am I going to do? I'm never going to use the furniture that they chose, so let's just delete that. I don't hate, like, the actual shell, though, like, the shape that they chose. I think I will turn this into a one-bedroom. This was a 30,000 simoleon house, and it wasn't even that big, so... It just started pouring hail outside, so if I abruptly stop, it means my power went out. Oh, God. <laughs> It's loud. I'm sorry if you can hear it, but I kind of need the window open because it was so hot yesterday. You just discovered the eraser tool a couple months ago. I know, right? This is the thing too. So a lot of things in The Sims 4 still work in The Sims 3. So check because a lot, actually I should say a lot of The Sims 4 build tools are just from like other Sims games, like Sims 2 and stuff. Okay. I don't like the doors either. I'm going to delete the doors. <laughs> I don't like anything that they did. <laughs> usually it's not this bad. Like, usually I'm like, okay, this is an all right room. 
I'm glad there's a white toilet. You know what? I'm I'm gonna leave that shower because they changed the shower to white. So that's all right. I don't like the candle. Delete. Sometimes when I renovate, I like to kind of go with their vision. Uh, for this build, we're not we're not we're not doing that. We're not interested in that. We're interested in making it look nice. But we had to change everything. Can I change this to metal? <laughs> Rotate, boom. It can be a double wide stair, I guess. Why don't I make it more lofty? I might actually do that. I know the music is just so Sims, like it's so Sims, cause, because it's a Sims 1 soundtrack, right? Oh my goodness. I don't like the dresser either. I'm deleting everything. I don't, I'm, I'm keeping their white bathroom. Keep in mind, they also had the stone tile in here. I might keep that as well. I like to keep at least some part of the build. Ew, delete that. But yeah, I mostly like to kind of get it all looking good. Sometimes there's like a build where like they were kind of on the right track. They just kind of screwed it up, right? So you can fix that. And sometimes there's just no hope. So you just have to, you just have to go for it. Realistically, there shouldn't be a wall here, right? It should just be like open. So I don't like that the bathroom is here. I would actually put the bathroom maybe over here instead. But they kind of need a little room here. Why doesn't it be? Uh, maybe it can be a laundry room. We were playing in live mode a little earlier for sure. I already have Kyle and I moved in just kind of down the street. Well, maybe we'll move into the house and kind of and kind of try it out a little bit. Bathroom sink in the kitchen, not happening. Okay, I have to really figure out how I'm doing this. Oh God. How am I gonna counter this? Can I do it like this way? No, it doesn't work like that. <laughs> I'm gonna do it like this. Okay, that looks a little more realistic. I need some lights actually, so that way everyone can see what's going on. The lights I'm choosing is just to kind of see everything. They're not necessarily the lights that I'm gonna be, like I would never light a, light a build like this. I like playing The Sims 4 with The Sims 4 camera, unpopular opinion. I understand why they have The Sims 4 camera. I think it's at the perfect angle. I think the rotation is perfect too. It's just for building it sucks. That's it. For me. In my humble, stifled opinion. Actually, these counters are ugly too, and so is the fridge. Let's change it. Okay, we'll just do the kitchen first because that's easy. Done, done. Boop. Here's my 30 second kitchen. Great. Done there. This can be why. Actually, you know what? We can do a new oven because this is not a starter house. This was already priced at thirty thousand. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna allow myself to pick something like a nice fridge, for example. Not a nice, nice stove, but I, uh, I'm gonna pick a stove that doesn't clip into the window, which is none of them, it seems. Ooh, I like this one, but it's, it's a DLC one. Ooh. This one, that's perfect. That's a that's a good color too. Then in the counters, let's do this. I want metal, yes. The top I'll do maybe ease. No, I didn't want to turn that. No, that's not, that's not what I wanted to do. Move, where's marble? Marble, masonry. That's marble, right? <laughs> Maybe rock and stone, that's better. Ooh, okay. Change that up a little bit, go here. Yes, got it. Okay, so I'm gonna drag this to the other counters. That's cute. Oh, thank you, Buttercup. It's just. It's just something I threw together. I want the sink to be metal too. Okay, metals, this one, sure. Okay, great. And that's and that's our kitchenette. 
Oh, garbage can can't be beige. Ew, black is fine. Ew, the lid is different. Okay, change that to ease. Okay, we got this going on. Maybe metal, actually. Right, I'd rather do the metal one. Now I'm in a metal kick. There we go, that's pretty. Put it over here. You've never seen that and you love it. Well, thank you. It was actually an accident because I just, I wanted a different window in the front. So this is what I mean when I say you just have to go with it. So the worst thing you can do with, when building is think. Like, just like, or I shouldn't say think. I should say stop and think. You should just constantly be doing things, right? Like, oh, maybe I don't like this here. Maybe, I, maybe I'm going to delete part of it. And then you delete part of it and you're like, ew, it's ugly. Then you just undo, right? You just undo, you go back. I just keep changing things. And then when it gets uglier, I revert. And when it gets prettier, I keep it. That's all it is. Let's get some furniture. I think I'm going to use this as a, hmm, it's kind of small. What were they using this for before? Nothing really. Oh God, I'm in create a style by accident. I mean, Kyle's more in the focus. Here's Kyle. He's back. I'm going to pet him. He had food, so he's, so, so he's full. He's not hungry. His eyes are crossed a little bit right now. Okay, great. So let's see. I want just like a little dinette then, I guess. I don't know. What 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 can I use this bay area for? Maybe just as an entryway. That might not be a bad idea, actually. Let's put down like a like a sofa and stuff just to get sorted and like a bed. I kind of want to delete the wall here. Delete this. Can I, can I delete the floor too? I'm just going to, I'm going to delete part of the upstairs because I don't think we're going to need the whole thing. Like that. Should we just do like a bachelor pad, like a loft? We could do like a loft. That might be cute. And the bathroom is, will have to be rearranged, but that's besides the point. Actually, the bathroom can go here. Renoing. I, ha I had to go back and see what house it was you were renoing because it's unrecognizable. <laughs> yeah, it was a craftsman EA disaster. That's all it. That's all. That's all it was before. There was nothing really, nothing to um, nothing to save. I was explaining earlier how sometimes with the houses I'll kind of go with their style. A reading nook. That's a that that's a great idea. It's actually too small for a study, and that's what I wanted to do. But a reading nook, that's better. Thank you. That's a great idea. Let's do that. Sometimes you just need like a little spit, you know, and like it it could be for like any skill, but sometimes you just need like a little corner skill items, and I think reading nook is perfect. I wait for everything to load. I haven't loaded any of the of the of the buy mode objects. Hi, Lara. How are you doing? Everyone say hi to Lara. Oh, this is cute. I never get to use my DLC items because I'm always trying to like make it accessible. It used to drive me crazy when people would like up like upload beautiful houses and I'm like, I don't have get together. <laughs> Ooh, most of these are not base game. Goodness. I don't like any of these. I like this one, but it's from the store or something. You know what? I'm just, I'm just going to go with Old Faithful. I thought I downloaded one. You know what? There might be a custom content share. No, I don't want to use a custom content share. I got to find a, like a nice color. For, that's fine, actually. Brighten it up a little bit. Great. Yeah, studies Victoria. You know, I love, I love Victorian houses. <laughs> this is Sunset Valley, absolutely. In your current Lepisy house, you have two writers, so they have a little writing nook. That, yeah, exactly. Like because you can you can make a writing nook like that, and then they can both use it. But then if you get another Sim who needs it for something else, you can kind of, you know, adjust it. Because like an uh, an an office is just like a reading nook with a computer. 
right? And then like an art studio is just a study with an easel instead of a computer. Good God. Go away, Naked HD. Nobody wants you here. Stop trying to make your website happen. It's not going to happen. There we go. Deleted. Delita. <laughs> that poor girl. I hope she's not deleted from life. Let's see what's going on. Where's my... Yeah, that one. Ooh, I like this one. It's too big. You know what? I don't ever get to use this ugly one. I'm going to do it. <laughs> no one can stop me. I need a plant. Maybe an end table and a plant. When you don't know what to do, put an end table in a plant. I want a bigger plant. Not that one. This one? Ooh, I like this one. Actually, I'm going to put the end table here. I'm going to put the plant here. And then maybe I'll put the phone on the table too. That's all right. I was shook when little Simsy of all people low-key admitted to, to pirating like all of her store content. Well, like, what was she, like, a suburban 14-year-old girl, like, in, in The Sims 3 days? Like, what else was she going to do? With what money is she buying Sims 3 stuff, you know what I mean? I'm an adult, I can't even afford this stuff. I'll, I'll put a Kleenex there in case they're reading a sad book. <laughs> I want this white. See if we can get like some of the tile inside. I don't hate the stone. I just want to see what the tile looks like too. I kind of like the stone. Actually, I'm going to leave the stone as the tile and then I'm going to change. I'm going to find a wood that we like. Let's try it. I'll do my how to make a nice wood flooring in the Sims. So first thing you do is you start off with this horrible orange one. It's actually not awful. I don't, I don't hate it. It's a bit bold. So this is actually, I might, I might leave it like this to see if we can get used to it. Cause I do like this flooring and it is tricky to use, but I find it works really well in black and white builds. It's very eco lifestyle, you know? Hmm, I want a bigger bathroom. I think that's good. Oh my God. Should the, I have an idea. <laughs> you can look through the bathroom out over into the other part of the house. <laughs> no, I'm not. I'm not going to do that. You're a grown adult with a good job and you look at the cost of the Sims 4 stuff and cry, or uh, the Sims 3 stuff and cry. Yep, absolutely. What I will say though about the Sims 3 store is that you don't need everything. Like it's not, it doesn't have that same complex that the Sims 4 has where I feel like I need to have every single pack. When I see something on the Sims 3 store that I'm not interested in, it doesn't bother me. Like I don't feel like I'm missing out, you know? Okay, I'll make like a little corner area there. We can have, yeah, we'll have this fine. It's here. Get rid of that light. We're almost done. I like the flooring too. Yeah, it's just, it, it's one of those you got to get used to it, right? I say this in my videos a lot, but I truly do believe like it's better to go too far and pull back a little bit. But when something is just not inspiring you know like if it's if it's neither here nor there it's not it's not ugly it's not pretty then it's nothing right <laughs> like it has to be something if when in doubt just make it ugly as hell makes people talk whatever life simmer had that's funny yeah because like some people would just buy the buy the items that they see like other people use because it's like you know that you see how you can use it so you know oh i love these lights for modern Yeah, we'll put the light there. I need a smoke detector maybe here. Make that like our little wall. Need to change our... Oh, I want tiles in the kitchen. Why was I... What was I thinking? Not those ones. 
I could probably get away with this just in a different pull this to here. Hmm. Yes. I knew I I knew I could use it. I just didn't know which which swatch. There we go. Great. Now we have our little kitchen. And it's all uh I don't know if I like the black. I might change the black to metal. I don't know why. I'm in this metal kick. Go away. I can't I can see all the story progression. Metals. Yes. Metallic kitchen. Love it. Ginger's here. You've been playing The Sims. Good. Kyle's Kyle's still here too. He's asleep. You're an old Sim City player and the old games still work and EA dropped the price on them. They just want to milk The Sims for all it's worth. Ugh, don't get me started. Yeah, like I think it's fun to play together. Like I like I like playing one player games, so I like so I like The Sims, but I, I I like when other people are playing the same one player game, right? I don't like people in my game, like <laughs> necessarily. I wouldn't mind doing it for like certain things. I keep saying that if like uh, the fifth Sims game or whatever has like multiplayer elements, that would be that would be something I'd be interested in. Hmm. I don't know if I don't know what to do with this bump out if the bathroom is over there. I'm just gonna kind of keep it there for the time being. How big is a bed? I need to see how big a bed is to make sure I have enough room up here. I remember being like eight years old and 400 items in your basket. Oh my God. Your parents saved the credit card into the computer and you're like, purchase. <laughs> and then your family loses their house, right? The end. <laughs> now you have nowhere to play The Sims with all your DLC. No, of course you didn't buy them. I know, of course not. I love this ugly green couch. It reminds me of The Sims 1. This is nice too. I love this couch. I use that in my like real builds. Uh, why is there no modern sofa in the base game? The Sims 4 has all sorts of ugly modern sofas in the base game. Hi, Venice. How are you doing? Oh, God, we're stressed. Actually, I'm going to take this color. I'm going to pull it over to here. I love how I already picked like the same from the same family of objects, and I didn't even mean to. So this room kind of needs a light like this. I'm going to leave this one here. Or should I have like a lamp light? Sometimes I think lamps are better. I don't like just using ceiling lights if I can avoid it. Not that one, though. Ew. Ooh, I want to use Katy Perry Sweet Treats. No, not that one. <laughs> I'm trying to use Katy Perry Sweet Treats. It's very difficult. This is what I wanted. There we go. We'll use that. Dun, 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 dun. There we go. Just trying to find like the best way to put these. Always hard with diagonal walls. That looks all right. Mess it up a little bit. I need a rug. A rug would help. Late night lights are the best for modern, but I agree. Okay, I'll put this in here. Uh, I, I kind of want an extra something. Can I put the wall lights here? Yes. Okay. So I so maybe I'll do this. Great. Move that out of the way. Sometimes I like to do like a little bit of a wall detail too. Like I might just like, maybe not this way, but then I can't do the garbage can. Maybe just like a little wall. Uh, I don't know if I like the wall, maybe a half wall actually. Whenever I'm not sure, I just kind of put a half wall like this. See, that's kind of cute. And then I can make it in the tile. Kind of adorable. Then we can put the dining kind of by it. I don't know. Maybe maybe this will turn into like the living area. I can make this like a sunroom. <laughs> oh my god, the upstairs should not have these windows. What was I thinking? I need smaller windows for the bathroom. 
Katy Perry Sweet Treats is best for a girl's bedroom. I don't disagree with that at all. Yep. That's the place to use it. If if you can use it, that's how it is. Ooh, look at these sweet panes. You can get candy studded windows. Actually, can I change the colors of those? No, I can't. Oh, they can. Okay, let's Do you have a normal one? Oh, <gasps> they do. They have a normal swatch. Okay, great. I'm using Katy Perry Sweet Treats. <laughs> Because realistically, if if you download this house and it's missing two bathroom windows, I think you can handle it. Great. Yes. Katy Perry Sweet Treats, baby. Come on. I hate windows. Oh my god. Why am I so spammed? I <sighs> Hide user. Got it. Got him. There we go. We got it. Okay, I'm just gonna take a step back first. I'm going to save. Please don't crash. I'm like, I finally got something I like. I like Showtime stuff too. How much is it now? Cozy Craftsman. It is no longer a Cozy Craftsman. I'll have to think of a new name for it. Okay. In hindsight, I do want to change this to black. Yes. Sometimes it's just easy to see all the things that like you want to change. I want to add this fence to the outside of here. Make that look better. There we go. Kind of cute. If the fence affects its functionality, I'm sorry. I don't I don't think it should. The front is fine. I'm just going to make this because there's already like grass and stuff around back here, so I just want to make it like more I don't know, more geometric. Done. I'll just kind of trace this around, I guess. There we go. I should make the railings black. That'll that'll kind of make it match too. Oh, that's not black. Oops. This is black. There we go. Kind of cute. Why doesn't YouTube do anything? It's the same account. Everyone blocks them, but they're still. Yeah, I don't know. I don't. I don't want to get into it. <laughs> How dare you upset me this close to showtime? Yeah, see that looks better than the stone, I think. Just like a nice you 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 could even do it like really fancy and like make it I'm not going to, but you could make it like uh glass kind of all the way around there. Okay, so we got the balconies, we got everything. I need a bed. Hmm. I like this bed, but it's from Island Paradise, I think. Ooh, Into the Future bed. That's stunning, actually. Love it. Thank you. I yeah, I do too. It's just it it's adding that extra touch. The 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 other thing I'm curious about is Oh my god, can I not change the fence? Ah. <gasps> Oh, I can. Okay, good. So I can change this to like black metal. What do we think? With the black or without the black? For the fence. I think with. Oh, cancel. So if you like hold shift and drag it over top, it's going to change all of them. Come on. There we go. Cute. Done. See, I always finick with the shell. I just, I just love it so much more. I'm going to put these here too, just to like edge it out a little bit. What if I put the flooring? I'm just playing a little bit more.
cool. I also don't like to make things like too luxurious for no reason, like unless I'm doing like a mansion. So adding a lot of detail is a little bit maybe counterproductive, but I don't hate this. I'm going to delete these columns, actually. I don't like these anymore. See you. I might actually change where the front door is. I think it's better like this. It's too many windows. Okay, I'm thinking, I'm like, <laughs> I'm nice and calm and freaking out internally, but it's fine. I think that's it for the shell. I don't think I'm gonna touch it. Well, unless I see mistakes, then I'll touch it. But other than that, I think we are okay to go. Or should the t I need a TV once I have a once I have a TV and a bed, then I'll know where all my stuff's going to point. They don't need like a big TV. This is like counterproductive. <laughs> that can be their dining area. I don't care if it's not next to the kitchen. Some things are more important, like our TV room. Is there a three tile for this one? Yeah, there is. OK, I'm just going to steal the swatch then. Great. Now I need a coffee table, something not ugly. Thank you. I'm going to make it white. Done. I need I need rugs. I've, I've, I've needed rugs for a while. I need my bed. I forgot. See, this is the problem. I don't I lack a lot of focus. It chugs a lot less now. You're like a swan gliding along the lake. I'm trying. I'm trying. I'm I'm trying to keep it fluid and not as intimidating because I know a lot of people are apprehensive about Sims 3 building and I just like to show that it's just as it's just as frustrating as Sims 4 building. <laughs> don't don't worry. <laughs> this is so ugly. Why is it a cow print by default? This bothers me. I think that's kind of the best place for the bed, though, even though it's in a weird corner. I'm changing the cow print. He can have zebra. Zebra? Do you guys say zebra or zebra? Because both are correct as far as I'm concerned. I want a metal bed frame. <laughs> I want metal everything. Yes. I want white sheets. No black sheets. Just not, just not a color. Please don't freeze. Yay, okay, we got it. You'd love to see a green toilet? Well, then you can look at literally any other house in this world and you'll find one. Don't worry, I believe in you. You have the power. <laughs> you say zebra, okay. I think zebra is like the British way to say it, I guess. I don't know. Cause like I say vitamin, right? Like, well, no, I say it depends if I'm saying like a noun, like I'm taking my vitamins, but in it, but if I'm reading a list, it's like that has vitamin C, that has vitamin B. I don't know. It's weird. It depends on the way I'm using the word. Ooh, I can do a metal floor. <gasps> Ooh, I'm putting that in the kitchen, not the bathroom. I think everything else is fine with stone. I, I need a little dinette set. Just gonna do some quick furnishing. I'm not. Uh, I. I'm not gonna spend too too much time on the furnishing. Usually, I just like to simple furnish my builds. Like I don't go too too crazy, just because for performance issues. Because some people have a hard time getting The Sims 3 to run anyway, let alone uh, with a bunch of stuff everywhere. And I know a lot of people are really, you know, they're much they're much more into decorating. So it's not that I don't furnish my houses. I still furnish them, but there's room if you want to like add something for your sim or if you want to take something away and replace it like it isn't it isn't too limiting i try to make it as as easy as possible okay there's my table and chairs i need rugs <laughs> i still need rugs after all this no maybe i should use the love seat too do it little simsy style a little Simsy living room. <laughs> I'm I'm gonna put a three seater, then a two seater, and then the single chair on the side. Done, right? <laughs> Actually, that's not too bad. <laughs> I was just making fun of it, but 
You know, maybe there's a reason why she does it. Yeah, I uh, I like I like cluttering my Sims 4 builds. I just find in the Sims 4 like it's over too quickly because there's only so you know, like it's kind of easier to just get your shell down. So, but with Sims 3, I find I enjoy my shells in the Sims 3 a lot better, but it takes me longer. So I have to like kind of put more into it. Where are the rugs? There they are. Oh my god, there's not that many rugs. Okay, let's take this rug and make it not ugly. That'll be our goal, our next goal. That's a pretty lavender color, isn't it? Too bad it doesn't look nice on the... Metal! <laughs> We're gonna do a metal rug. I do miss the search bar. Natalie, I agree. Hmm. It's gonna be a... It's gonna... It's gonna be a fun trip. You know, let's just do a black rug. Let's do it. I'm gonna take this this texture, just blacken it up. That's nice. Okay, if I take this, darken it up a little bit. Might be nice. Kinda nice. Do we like it? I don't know. It's the couch or the chair. I don't really want both. Because this is like too many seating areas for this house too. Like it's kind of unnecessary. Now I have this big rug. Uh, I think I'm going to get rid of the chair for sure. Every EA build has this like diagonal problem too. They're like, let's make everything on a diagonal. <laughs> Actually, what do we, I don't hate it. Do we hate it? I don't, I really don't. The Sims 3 is a lot, is a lot more work to build with, but the final product is amazing. Yes, I can get on board with that. Especially if you're new to the Sims 3, your first build is gonna drive you crazy, but it is kind of worth it. I'm gonna go back over to Kyle more. Kyle, come in, come in. He just flipped over. That's it. Oh my god. I need a smaller rug. And then I'm going to take this and I'm just going to drag it right onto the rug so I can just change it. Perfect. Now they match. Look at that. See, this is my favorite thing because this is something you would never be able to do in The Sims 4. I want these two rugs to be identical and it's going to take me an hour to make the first rug, but then one second to make the second rug because I can just drag it over. I'm still trying to find the best way to do this. <laughs> oh my God, this guy is back. I feel like I'm just an advertiser for this stuff now. Like my goodness. I saw a, uh, a pickup truck yesterday and the, no, not a pickup truck, um, a sports car. I can't tell the difference. And, um, this lady had her like OF account on her wind, like on her window, like on, like on the, I was going to say windshield, but it's like in the back seat window or something. I know the bot is back. Yeah, it's awful. I can't figure out the way I want this living room. So I'm just going to make my bedroom. I need some end tables. See, the other thing I like to do too, to save time is like now I need end tables. So I'll just take that other end table that I, that I already used and then I'll just kind of put put it in a couple places just to, you know, get ready. There we go. Need a dresser, kind of. God. Where are you? I need a modern dresser, but I need it to be from the base game and it's not going to be that's close enough. I think, I think this is as good as it's going to get for me. You can be metal too, actually, as far as I'm concerned. Yas. Oh yeah. And then like the wood, the wood at the top, I'm going to drag this, this color. Yes. 
Do it. How's that? Actually, I don't hate that. You want to go for half British, half American style? Yeah, I used to... Okay, in The Sims 4, this is, this is me building in The Sims 4. Watch. Like that. I like everything. I'm like, oh, whoop, oh, oh, he's messy. It's on an angle. Ha ha ha. Look at me go. Whoop, done. Like, I don't know. It just drives me crazy. Oh, guaranteed that bot is a virus. Do not, do not click on it. Hmm. I might leave the balconies empty too. Hmm. Maybe I want this here. Yeah, this actually kind of makes more sense. Let's do it like that. Okay, I'm gonna make the end tables all metal too up here. Maybe not the one downstairs. Nice. Done. Okay, get rid of that. Double that one down. Hmm, I need a mirror. I need a bathroom. I'm gonna spend time on my last bathroom. That'll be like where all my love and care goes. Right, I didn't figure out down here yet. I'm gonna do a little office space. A modern desk that isn't ugly, kind of. Okay, we'll use that one. This is already 41k. I'm sorry, I didn't realize how how high my budget went. That's a good computer. We'll use that. Get his chair. I thought I downloaded a really nice CC chair, but I can't find it, so I don't remember if I didn't install it or something. I love this chair, <laughs> but I don't think it's for this build. Actually, it could be. Do we have like a non-ugly office chair? No, probably not actually. Now, saying it out loud, I'm like, yeah, I don't think so. That's cl as close as we're gonna get. I'm gonna make it white. This house is just some, we're just fixing Sunset Valley because it's so hideous. We're just doing it one build at a time whenever I feel like it. So this used to be like a craftsman house. Now it's a modern house. <laughs> I don't know how else to how else to say it. But yeah, this isn't for anyone specific. This is like one of the townie house or eh, sorry, it's not it uh it's not a townie house. It's just like um an empty starter house. Not a starter, but almost a starter. It's not a starter anymore, especially after I got through with it. I'm just, after all that, I think I'm just gonna keep this flat in the middle. I wish this rug was slightly smaller. I might do this. Give me one moment. I'm gonna see if, I'm gonna see how this, how this one looks. Cause this might fix my whole problem. It might actually. I think, I think I have my problem solved now. There we go. Now it looks like a Sims house. <laughs> Thank you. I, I I absolutely did forget the security alarm. Okay, let's get that going right here. Perfect. Actually, I'm gonna move the phone. I already have a phone, right? Oh no, I don't. I have to I have to put the phone here. I'm gonna put the phone next to the Kleenex and the books. That's close enough. Hmm, clock, why not? Yeah, I'll put it like over the desk. I do I do still like to decorate. Okay, I need I need to pick my real lights now. I need to pick the ones I want to use. So I have the fluorescent lights in here. I want one good ceiling light for the living room, but nothing more. I want something nice. Oh I I, <laughs> I took a screenshot by accident. Twinbrook needs its own. See, Twinbrook. Ugh. Twinbrook, I'm going to rebuild. I don't think I'm going to renovate. I think I'm going to just bulldoze everything and start over. Like, I I think it'll be faster for me. Honestly, I like without even being shady. I just think it'll be faster for me. I'm using this beautiful light. Sorry. It's not it's not going to be a hundred percent base game. I'll use that there. We need some floor lamps, maybe. Hmm, where is my best place for this? 
This is tricky though, because the living room's kind of in the middle, right? So I can't really get away with that stuff. I might I might put the I might put two hanging lights. That is not like me at all. But I think it's what we have to do. I will use this for upstairs. Put that in the hallway. Maybe a wall light too. I'm gonna get a wall light for the bathroom. Let's do the half bathroom too. So, so in that way, like the down the um the downstairs is done. I'm gonna put a counter up here so I have it ready. I think I'm just gonna use a pedestal sink. A pedestal sink. I want to finish the build. Like I'm not. Don't worry. I'm not. I'm not gonna leave. Yeah, uh, I was thinking because I'm, I'm uploading each one to the exchange. But I think at the end I'll just put it into like a save file. Not in this save file because it's been played a couple days and story progression screwed everybody up. So like I'll put all the builds into a fresh. Sunset Valley without any mods. Sorry, yeah, like uh, without any mods or CC <clears throat> or DLC. One second, I lot <clears throat> losing my voice. See, I think it's still there. Sometimes I don't know if I'm losing my voice or not. Good news for everybody else, but maybe not for us. My neighbors will be like, "Thank God he stopped screaming." Hi, James. We are having a good day. Well, most of us, I think. I don't want to speak for everybody. Okay. While we finish up the build, is there anything anyone wants to discuss or talk about or is upsetting them or wants to you know alleviate some anxiety because we are because we are here but we have been here for over three hours so we're definitely in the final hour of the stream i would say i know sometimes people like to just kind of share things because they have nowhere else to go because i get it the real world not interested i'm slowly adjusting back into the real world i'm just not there yet i hope one day to at least pass as normal once again Wow, I love this mirror. I'm using it. Done. You've only seen my videos. Well, welcome. Yeah, chat about sim stuff. Okay, I want like a... Okay, the toilet can be here. I want a bathroom. I can put a shower downstairs, actually. That's fine. There's no, there's no reason I can't fit that. I think the toilet should be the further. Uh, I don't know. Why can't I put the toilet next to the uh, stupid thing? That there. Why can't I do both? I hate this. Okay, you know what? Forget it. We're not. We're not doing the shower. Shower can go back up here. I want a bathroom though. Like I, I want it to be baths. Come on, stay there. Need a tub. Need a tub. <laughs> Where's my bathtubs? I'm gonna use it like tub nouveau. Ugh, I, I don't like that one. I love this shower. I don't know what this is from. It's from something from the store, but I love it. I think it's amazing. Oh, I'm sorry to hear about that. I hope I hope everything's going as well as can be. That's no fun. I, uh, I will mention, I taught first aid in CPR for like years and years, and it's a really great way to just feel more confident in situations like that. Because realistically, people just have a much better shot if you know exactly what to do right away. It's a time thing, right? So like, sometimes like when a, when a family member goes through a cardiac episode or something, then, you know, people are more motivated in the family to just learn in general. And it's just, yeah, and I think it's good. Like, maybe even for the next person, too, right? Because realistically, everyone's going to have a heart attack right? <laughs> at some point. So it's always better to be prepared. So that might be something to look into. Maybe you and a family member could go together and you can make, like, a fun day out of it. And I, and I, think, and I think you'd both feel a lot better. 
But not like right now, of course, right? In time. Something to think about. I just like to tell everyone that because then, you know, the more people who know, the more people who think about it, the better it is. This light needs to be brighter. I don't think that's bright. Look how dark this light is. Ah, I hate it. I'm going to take the other light. Okay. Oh, nice. You did it in, uh, in, in high school. Did they have someone come into your class and like teach it or like into the gym or something? I, I used to teach at the high school gym sometimes. They'd like, they would bring in a few, uh, a few grades. Oh, I love these. Perfect. I don't think I like that way though. Okay. I I like doing double counters, but I only put one sink. Hi Fizzy Pop, how are you doing? Okay, that one can be like that, and then I'm gonna steal the tile. I'm gonna put it in here. So the bath is like in a separate room. The shower can be downstairs for all I care. I'm putting it back. I'm doing the little Simsy bathroom. I'm sick of thinking about it. This is a this is a six tile bathroom. She always does six tile bathrooms and this is how she does them. She puts the shower and then the, uh, sorry, she puts the sink and the toilet next to each other and then the shower by itself. Done. <laughs> there we go, we have a functional bathroom. I want to take maybe a little bit of tile. Just spice it up a little bit. Ooh, I actually don't hate the whole thing being the tile. This tile is a bold choice, but it's working. Oh my god, the bot's back. I'm sorry. I'm trying my best. See, if you notice, every bot has a slightly different name. So they are all just like different accounts, like being mass created or something. But I don't, I, I don't understand it. Don't get me started. <laughs> now I'm second guessing my kitchen. I just want to see what it looks like one tile longer. Eh, uglier. Go back. Okay. On a sim stream. Like this is so, and for anyone who knows me and knows my content, like it does not go into a flirtatious dating realm. Like even when my sims are dating, I'm like you. I need you to get pregnant. Like I don't like I'm there's no romance. There's none of that. I just I don't it things like that are just not important to me. Like I'm not a I'm not one of those I'm not a sappy person, right? I'm a I'm a robot. I want babies. <laughs> and I want I want babies and I want them now. I hope I hope I get someone pregnant with quads. That's all I'm thinking about. I'm not I'm not thinking about I'm gonna get married. <laughs> Because I know some, some Sims content skews a little more flirtatiously, which is fine for other people. For me, it makes me uncomfortable. So just knowing right now, if anybody is flirty with me or anything, no, I don't, I don't do that. I don't like, I, ugh, not for me. Doesn't mean I don't like you. It just means I'm grossed out. I know, right? I don't want to think about the real world. I'm scared. My life is always changing so hard. And it's like, ah. And everything is so expensive and like, I don't know what's going to be happening in a couple months. Like, you know, it's always, I'm always thinking ahead, but every year it gets less certain. So I don't know what to do. Ooh, I have to fix this. There we go. Put that up there. Well, I guess those bots aren't really romance. I watch, I watch some, like, the thing is, I don't watch as much anymore. Uh, making a YouTube video takes way longer than you think it does. <laughs> I don't know how else to say that. It's, like, hours of editing, right? So I'm not watching content if I'm making it. So. Can you imagine the real world trying for baby until you hear chai? I wish. Honestly, that's fine. 
they heard they heard babies so they're like yeah oh my god because the thing is, yeah because like you can talk about like sexuality and dating and families and stuff in the sims very explicitly but without it being sexualized right like i can say have my babies and have it not be abrasive or offensive you know because it's because it's the sims <laughs> like it's just how it is right but in a different context it might come across very weird right if I if I was playing any other video game that 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 would be I, I would say unacceptable <laughs> I'm gonna hang a plant in the bathroom why not I have no reason not to you guys can't stop me nobody can stop me Ooh, no wait that's why am I putting flowers outside I told myself I'm not going back outside I want the rubber tree plant actually I'm gonna put that in the corner delete the end table get a plant is there room for another plant yeah I'll just stick a second one no problem for that. Actually, I kind of like the rubber tree plant better, so I'm going to put that in the reading room, and then I'll put the fern here. Wisteria. For only Sims, I only watch this channel in Cotton Sock, so just Sims 3 people. I love Maddie's videos. She got a different style of gameplay, too, right? Like, I don't like people... I shouldn't say I don't like people. I much prefer... Um, I'm trying to be more positive. I much prefer simmers who have a different twist on it than than I than I do. You know what I mean? Like I find I learn a lot more, as opposed to like everyone playing The Sims the same way. I don't like I don't think that's advantageous to us, because then everyone builds the same house and does the same stuff. I need art, but I don't know if there's any modern art in this. Katy Perry sweet treats. That's what we're going to do. Oh, it doesn't even fit on the wall. There we go. <laughs> Thank you so much, Toast. It's my favorite room, too. It's the first one I did. I'm kind of, like, predisposed to kitchens. I'm changing the lights, though, I just noticed. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put the nice ones. Maybe I should put those instead. Maybe I'll put the smoke detector by the sink. This here. Hmm, yeah. Yeah, because two of those lights is brighter than four of the other ones. Yeah, please. Like, if there's anything you can do um, to stop those bots and stuff. Yeah, like, for sure. Because, like I said, um, anyone who knows, like, my Discord and stuff, I, I work very hard to keep it a safe space and an all-ages space. That's very important to me. And that's also why none of my content is, like, dating-related and stuff, too, because I just don't think it's appropriate for the entire audience that I have. I think some of the, I think some of the, some of my audience is bitter old bastards like myself. And I think some, I shouldn't say that in front of kids, I guess, but it is kind of like, I keep in mind the Sims is rated T for teens. So I don't feel I should have to keep it family friendly, but I'm definitely keeping it friendly for like teenagers, right? Because like, that's the audience for the Sims, right? Rated T for teens. So that's what my community should be appropriate for. So something like this Tinder bot is not acceptable, right? But 13-year-olds swear, so if I slip one out, then it's fine. 13-year-olds swear more than I do, too. I think I'm, I think I'm pretty good. For, for an adult man from Alberta, I don't swear very much. You're the bitter old queen. Yep, yeah, me too. <laughs> we, we, can, we, can rule, we can rule over Sunset Valley together. Bitter old B over here. There you go. Well, and like, I just know, like, when I found online communities when I was a teenager, thankfully, I found lots of safe, positive ones too, right? But like, I think that's important. Because a lot of people who kind of like reach out to like the Sims community and just kind of be a, and like, you know, kind of integrate themselves into it. These are people who don't really have necessarily a safe place to go in their real life. Right. We don't know what country people are from. We don't know what their, you know, what their circumstances are. And quite frankly, most people are gay and trans that I know. So you can be a bitter young queen. You can be anything you want. That's the whole point. Right. I love the rug. I'm sorry. I was wait. Oh, OK, I was. I've been driving myself crazy for like an hour trying to get this to look nice and the rug just did it. What do we think? I think that's the last touch. I love it. So I'm from Niagara Falls. I moved to Toronto when I was 17. 
uh, to go to university. I stayed there for about 10 years. Um, you're as young as you feel. You're as young as the girl you feel. That's what I heard anyway. And I'm actually, I'm not, I'm not even going to say my age. I'm going to let people keep guessing. Some people know my age. I'm not ashamed of my age. I just think it's funny. I'm just trying to, I'm trying out my tiles. I want to see if I can use these outside. No, it's hideous. I'm trying it. Sorry, I have to. What do we think of that? Is it like a little pop of color? I need something, but I don't think that's it. Okay, our... Why is there... Oh, sorry. There was a carpet on the lawn because I was playing around and I just wanted to keep it there just in case. This empty corner is bothering me, so I have to find something to put. So the plant goes in the corner here. What can I put here? Maybe an end another end table? That's my answer to everything, an end table and a plant. Let's find sculptures, actually. Ooh, cotton candy. I'm going to put a Katy Perry sweet treats thing on the lawn just to... Because people won't miss it, but they'll have it. Oh, thank you so much. That's so sweet. You don't have to super chat me. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Take a little bit of the pressure off. Yeah, this isn't a Victorian house. Somebody was really kind of snarky and was just like, you can only do one kind of that. And anyway, I usually get positive comments. Like when I get like a bitchy one, I get like really into it. So it was funny. And they're like, you don't know how to do anything except build Victorian shells. And I was like, so you can't even do that. <laughs> and now I'm building a modern house to prove them wrong. Ottawa. So Ottawa. Um, I lived in Ottawa. So... If I say Pat, Alvin, Andrew, do those names kind of ring a bell? Those are like my closest. I'm not saying last names. I'm not doxing anybody because do you know, do you know a guy named Andrew? Like that's going to be funny. But yeah, so um, I've been to tease. It's very underwhelming. Um, that's about it. <laughs> computer. I already have a computer. That's the thing I was going to, but I had this empty corner, right? So I used the computer for this empty corner. Oh my God. Now it's undo. Okay. So I, so I have a reading nook here, computer here, what, skill building item. Why don't we get like an instrument or something? I don't know. Okay. I'm definitely going to put a rug and I'll put a painting on the wall here and then I'll put, Ooh, I can put a stereo. I just wanted to put something, right? Okay. That's way too big. What was I thinking? That's fine. I'll just put a stereo here. Or should I put the stereo at the end of the bed? I kind of like it there. It might be a little rectangular though, so we'll have to check. What's this runner look like? When I change it. No, I didn't. I really like um I did I did all my partying in Toronto. Like I only know Toronto places and Toronto people for the most part. Actually, most of them hate me. I love it. I accidentally destroyed, like, a social hierarchy before fleeing. Oh, my God. The cotton candy tree. Yes. Let's do it. Katy Perry moved in. No, I can't. I can't. I could do the lollipocalypse. <gasps> Gumball drop. That's even uglier. Oh, my God. Where is lollipop? There it is. Lollipocalypse. What do we think? I don't know if I can do it. I tried. Guitar, let's do a guitar. What was I thinking? I got distracted again. Is it entertainment? Blah, 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 phone. Where are the guitars? <laughs> are they not in this section? I I have it. Oh, okay, got it. Hobbies and skills. Stupid. I'm gonna put a telescope on the one balcony. Great. Maybe I'll point it the other way. It won't go that way for some reason. Okay, it'll it'll go this way. And we'll put a guitar in the corner. Kind of next to the stereo. I don't like this rug. I'm gonna just change it. I don't know if I need a rug. I think I what what I really need is a different flooring. What if I did the top floor like the metal? I don't hate that. Then I can do this. 
Yeah, let's just do this. I'll just I'll just do the stone and then the metal floor in the bedroom. It's kind of badass. Okay, are we almost done? I think so. And I didn't and I didn't freak out. I didn't get sick. The last live build I did, I got so nauseated. My goodness. Kyle, what do you think? Fine, wake up. His his little toe beans. <laughs> Thank you. I agree. I think it looks better. I'm not putting a foosball table in. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. <laughs> Actually, I don't know if you can change the color of Lollipocalypse um, to that extent. I believe you can change it, but I don't believe you can change it. I think something will like remain ugly no matter what I do, like those stripes. Maybe not. Ooh, maybe not. Because some of the Katy Perry stuff is just like unreal. Hurry up. Okay, I'm gonna try this. Hi, Gabriel, how are you doing? I, well, this, well, this is the thing, like, the Katy Perry pack is just so peculiar that it's so hard to use, right? See, some of them are still ugly, but you know what? Now it's less ugly. I'll leave it there. People can delete it if they want, actually. Why not? We're all in the interest of fun, right? Oh, don't forget to like the stream, everybody. I always forget. It's been three and a half hours. My goodness. How many people are here? You're still here? What's wrong with you? Oh, my God. You're all nuts. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Like, the blue is there. Why are some of these see-through? Do you notice that? Like, the black one? It's kind of see-through. I don't know. It's all right. Okay, we're almost done. Uh, I just, I need, I need lights. <laughs> Pretty much it. I'll do a, where's my, those are fine. I can put this here. I'm going to put a little end table in the bathroom. And we'll put something on it, like a little, like a, like a little plant. Tiny, tiny plant. That's huge. That's too big too. Yeah, there we go. A little flower. That looks all right, doesn't it? I wish I could sneak it behind. I guess I could with move objects. Hmm, this is smaller than I wanted it to be. You have a habit of taking Sims too seriously, and then I add an alien or plumb bot, and that's as far as I go. I like plumb bots. My friend is playing with a plumb bot now, and she's and she's enjoying it. I haven't done one in a while. I didn't do any windows at the back of the house. Look at me doing an EA, just missing a whole section of windows. Are you really gonna not let me do that? Because of the, oh, the wall light. I was like, why? Why can't I do that? I'm just deleting the toilet paper roll if it's not going there. Okay, I'll put the thing there. There we go. It kind of needed a window anyway. I think that's enough. I don't think we need a third one. No, we're good. Okay, I think that pretty much does it for the build. Did I forget anything? I don't think so. I'm gonna save it. <laughs> so you go to edit town, so you can save it. And I'm gonna move in my sim, so that, that way we can move in Kyle and stuff, and just kind of check him out, and I'll bring him back over, and we'll kind of do like our denouement for the stream. I can't believe I've been live for three and a half hours. My goodness. It's like 4 p.m. I have chores to do. Oh my goodness. I was supposed to clean up some things. Okay, it's saved. So we're good to go. I know. Plumbots are awesome. Okay, I have to go to the washroom quick too. So I'll bring back Kyle over to entertain you while I'm gone. Wikowski would like to remind you to subscribe. Look at his name. Kyle is a girl because I didn't realize you had to pick the gender of your animal. <laughs> so Kyle is a girl, but he looks like Kyle. She looks like Kyle. Kyle is gender fluid as far as I'm concerned, so it doesn't really matter. 
Kyle likes all pronouns. Kyle was supposed to be a girl, so I named him Kylie, but then he was a boy, so now he's Kyle. Better than 12 a.m.? Yeah, but I go to bed at like 8. Like, I'm tired. <laughs> okay. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, moving. Okay, where am I going? How do I do this? Yeah, sure, I'll just change active household and then I'll just move it. Okay, now I'm in edit town, so now I know what to do. Where's the, where's monotone? Is this it? Yes, okay. Evict. Oh, I, oh no, I'm gonna need some money. Actually, I can just do free real estate on. So move out. Okay. There's so much fur on my keyboard because of petting Kyle earlier. Okay. Lace, where is it? Here, this is it, right? Oh, I have to change the uh the um the name of everything. We thought my cat was a girl till we had to remove something. <laughs> yeah, Kyle's fixed. Okay, I've moved into my house. Household name. Lad name. Uh... Pretentious Palace. Since EA loves their alliteration. Uh, zero bedrooms, two bathrooms. If you were, I, I guess I should put one bedroom, even though it's not a bedroom. Oh my God, why did I do that? I hit escape. What did I call it? I forget already. Pre pretentious Palace. Household name subscribed, sure. Once a hideous orange and green craftsman, the genius Rikowski <laughs> I don't know what else to call it. Don't forget to put the cat stuff. I'll put the cat stuff after. Uh, I don't want to promise it. That's a little pretentious for me. Despite a long and ugly history, this build, this house, fortunately, I don't want to like talk about myself, but they always talk about the Sims inside, right? Kyle's stretching. Oh my God, he's stretching. Despite a long and ugly history, this house was once part of the original, the original style of Sunset Valley. Today it stands proud as an, uh, Or in textural landscape. See, I'm not a good writer. I'm a much better speaker. None of my videos are really scripted unless my face is hidden. If you can't see me, that means I'm on a script. But if you can see me, then that means I'm just talking. So it's hard for me. So let's see. Despite a long and ugly history, this house was once part of the original style of Sunset Valley. Today, it stands proud as an outlier in the abhorrent architectural landscape. Bye, Natalie. Have a good night. We're almost done. I'm just wrapping up, too. I want to upload this, too, right? You select and go in. I might upload it a little bit later because I'm jumping into the house right now. God, I'm hungry again. I should eat soon, too. This is the other thing, too. It's like I feel like, 
oh, like I can go for longer. I can go for longer. But like realistically, like I need to like, eat stuff too, right? And do things. So, okay. Let's go. Where's Kyle? Oh my God. He's looking at the garbage. Of course he is. Okay. Let's see. So here is our beautiful, mo honestly, like, I think it's Aurora Skies is next. Sorry. I just saw, I just saw the question. Aurora Skies will be next. It's received the most votes on the community tab so far. And we've already got almost 2000 votes. Usually about 2000 people vote. That's it. So I think that's about it. You should really try to sleep. It's only it's only 4 p.m. in Calgary, 3 p.m. in Vancouver, right? There we go. So here is our gorgeous, pretentious palace, our our modern, glorious house in the middle of Sunset Valley. Now, this is the thing, like, I am pretty conceited and stuff like that. Like, I think I'm great, right? So I but I still don't like to like sound like that. But look at the other houses. Like, this is incomparable. This is not because I'm a great builder. This is just because I'm a decent builder. James L, welcome to be member. Oh my God, I love it. You make me cry. I'm so happy. Welcome. Thank you. you have Kyle emojis. Show them off. So anyway, my point is like, I don't like, I don't want to be like, look how beautiful my house is, but look at it compared to like that. Like, what the hell is that? You know, like I just don't. It doesn't scream anything to me, right? There's a couple good houses in Sunset Valley. I don't think we can see any of them from here. You see, like, it's just, I don't know. But I do like how Sunset Valley, it's kind of um, hidden ugly, right? Everything in Sunset Valley kind of blends in together in the same muddy mush, so it's okay. Twinbrook, that thing needs to be put into its place. Starlight Shores, I think, should be right after Aurora Skies, if my prediction is correct. So, but like I said, it's all up, it's all up to the votes. Oh, Kyle emojis. Yay, James has the Kyle emojis. Look at that. Okie doke. So, we're going to have Kyle. Uh, don't worry, I'm, I'm definitely ending. So, here comes our tour. This is our pretentious palace, and if you look at our neighboring houses, you will see how horrible they are by comparison, because of course, we're perfect. So going up here, <laughs> my god, this was so tricky too. I'm surprised it turned out as good as it did. And to your right, you will see the lovely Lollipocalypse from the British issue of, I do put a washing machine in the kitchen. Yeah, I do, I understand that, and um, I do that sometimes as well. I much, I much prefer British style houses, but this is Sunset Valley, and most I actually I shouldn't say most of my audience is American. That's that is not true. It's only about 20 to 30 percent. I don't like the single mom's house. It's called um, a Silamar and it's butt ugly. <laughs> I, remember, I remember that. So here's our gorgeous kitchen, which is perhaps the best room in the whole house. So why don't we just end the stream on the kitchen? <laughs> no, I like it. I actually really like it. One of the things I've been trying out is putting metal on things and I find it working out really nicely. Going in here, we have our sunroom slash reading nook where you can take a phone call and cry yourself to sleep in your armchair. You know, you can do all sorts of things. Oh my God, I lost control of the camera. Okay, and into the living room that has way too many chairs. I just didn't know what else to do. I didn't put anything under the stairs. Sometimes I do. In Italy, it's past midnight. Oh my God. But Derica, how did you like my Italian? Ciao. Oggi finiamo giudicare la casa di Montevista. So I'll remember that forever. I like I have a good memory once I get something, but before I get something, it's never going to happen. Let's see. Oh, up here. Ah. You can see the pond from the toilet. I don't mind a big window in a bathroom as long as the window faces something like this. Like it like it's not facing someone else's back door, right? A beach house? It, I could see that being like a beach house. Okay. Yes. Yeah, so my so my pockets of fans. So it's South Africa, Eastern Asia, Eastern Europe, a <laughs> little bit of Western Europe, um, and uh, then I would say yeah, like U.S. Yay, Canadian. See, we're not all nice. I want to break that stereotype. It's like, Canadians are so nice. And it's like, yeah, try and get me going and we'll see who's nice. Okay, let's go to the empty balcony with just a, just a telescope. I actually love this, like, 
this is a good lot for Sunset Valley. Look for the ugly craftsman house across from the Alvies, and you'll find a beautiful lot. Oh, there's Kyle. I can see him over the balcony. He's still looking at the garbage. Let's see what he does. He's thinking of the clean house. Yeah, I wish I... Uh, my, my bathroom doesn't even have a window now. My old bathroom did. But Federica is in Italy, so she obviously has a giant bathroom. Oh, you're from Minnesota. Love it. You have the same accent as us then. I hide my accent. It's fine. Okay. I just want to get back into this. Okay. Oh my god, I lost control again. There we go. So coming upstairs, I kind of like the bedroom. Southwest, y'all. Love it. So I yeah, so this is actually like in first person. I really I I uh, I really like this bedroom. Sometimes just cutting away some of your floor here for like the railing to look over it can be really really nice. It just it just adds an extra dimension, right? The third dimension. I'm kidding. I don't know what I'm talking about with that. Here's my metal bed with zebra print. I don't hate it. If anything, it looks modern. I want to see the bathroom. That's kind of what I'm interested in. My favorite thing is bathrooms. So. It's all right. It's a little dungeon-y, right? But I like how it's got two separate rooms. So then you have like the toilet room that you can go in here for the tub, right? Having the tub separate, I think is fine. I don't know. What do we think? I think it's all right. I would give this, it, it's hard because I'm, tr I'm trying to grade against my own self, right? This is probably in the stronger half of builds I've done or renovations for sure, but it's not my best. Hmm. I'd say 7, 7.5-ish for me. Maybe 8. I did, I did some nice tiles. I'm like, ah, I can give myself 8. Here, I'm going to fix one thing, then, then we can make it 8. There we go. I just want to change the railing. Okay. Now, now it's an 8. Great, and all for the low, low price of $54,366. Great, okay, let's save. And then we'll do our denouement with Kyle and I'll just kind of go back into full screen and we'll just chat a bit and pet Kyle and that'll be it. My goodness. It's not an 11, but thank you. It's a, it's a Sunset Valley 11. I would say it's a Sunset Valley 11. <laughs> that I would give it. It's also kind of like on the smaller side. It's outside of my, like, I wouldn't say completely outside of my comfort zone. If I'm doing a moderate sized house, modern is the way to go for me. Uh, Victorians kind of have to be mansions and then otherwise I do tiny houses. I feel, I feel like the corner needs a tree to block it from our view. That's the spirit. Let's do it. Let's, what's the biggest, oh, there we go. <laughs> Done. <laughs> Thank God. <laughs> we got it. <laughs> it's, it's over. We don't have to look at plus plus ever again. It's a twin brook one million. I agree. Yeah, like Mikhail, like you can try it in the same style or try it in a different style too, right? Because sometimes it's nice to see where a different concept goes too, right? Because I almost went with the craftsman style. I was going to clean it up and make it look nice. But then I realized that I don't think craftsman is that pretty. So I just, I just changed it all, right? But I think that there was, that there was potential for it. It's just not my style, so I couldn't really do it, right? It wasn't, it wasn't something that I'm adept at. I knew if I did a black and white modern house, I could actually make something pretty for everybody. How do I get this? Uh, I'll get it on the exchange in a second, too. That way everyone can download it. I call my... Um, for, for these Sunset Valley renos, I'm calling them rec renos, like R-E-K renos. You'll see in a second. Oh, I have to put... Okay, so Kyle and I are going to be in it, but it's not going to be... Ew. Do I have to move him out to share the house? Really? This is stupid. I'll do it later. Okay. Yeah, it's definitely an, an Airbnb house, I would say, more than anything. Okay, take that away. Save and quit. I'm going to get my full camera here. 
Can you believe Kyle just sleeps there as I'm screaming? You're back. Okay, well we just we just closed, but uh you can always rewind if you want to see the build. But um if if you want the sim separate, yes, you have to. I thought so, because that's what I've always thought. And I just thought like here we are, right? Do I look rough today? Not I don't know. Some days I look like 10 years older than than other days. I have no idea why. But today I think I, I'm I'm doing all right. I never know until I'm full screen and then I'm like, what am I, what am I looking like? Yeah, Kyle's a floofy boy. Okay, so we're gonna back here. If I'm making kissy faces at the camera, it's because I'm looking at Kyle in my monitor. Hang up. He just lies down again. Yeah. Ow, my foot. <laughs> okay. So. We're going to pose together. Doing all these faces. He has to feel it. He has no choice. Yeah, I'm 22 today. I love it. I'm 22. Believe it. <laughs> I know. He's so sweet. I just have to get him loving me again. Oh. I fed him, so he'll, so he'll put up with a lot for food. He loves it. Do some Kyle pets. He doesn't escape though. Like I can make him stay, you know, whatever I want. He hasn't put up too much of a fight. Unless he thinks your cat just meowed at Kyle. I love it. Your cat's in love with Kyle. Oh my God. See, now he wants to eat. So the problem is, is that he's pretty chill until he remembers food again. Like is like it, if he gets in like, I'm hungry, then he's gone, right? I don't know. Well, that pretty much does it. Thank you so much for falling for my clickbait thumbnail and joining me to build in Sunset Valley while Kyle slept in the background. But at least I had a lot of fun because I really enjoyed learning more about the create a sim tools with, um, I guess, create a cat, right? Create a pet. So I learned a lot from that. Thank you so much to who helped me out because now I can do probably anything because now I know how to navigate the advanced option, right? The other thing I really enjoyed was doing a completely flipped renovation. I don't usually do that. I usually build things from scratch or I renovate things within their style, right? I usually don't delete everything inside and like re-renovate it, but I did. And that then it kind of turned into something nicer. I really enjoyed the modern house. I will put it on the exchange. Just kind of keep an eye out if you want or whatever. And add me to The Sims 3 if you haven't already. And I also want to say something because I want... Thank you so much for all the gifts on The Sims 3. I opened a lot of them. I haven't opened all of them, but I'm saving some for a build challenge. So when you send uh, gifts on The Sims 3 store, uh, sorry, on The Sims 3 store, on The Sims 3 exchange, when you accept them, they just go into the household that you're currently playing. So I was thinking of making a new Sim, moving her into an empty lot, and then just opening like a bunch of gifts from you guys. And we have to furnish the house with just those gifts. And you guys don't get to choose which gift. You, you're sending surprise boxes. So it might be a um, Victorian end table. It might be lollipocalypse. Like you, we don't know, right? So it's, it's kind of like that each room is a different this, but the whole house is like that. So that's what I'm thinking of doing. So please, oh, one second. The, the audio stream's current. Bit rate is lower than the, I don't know. My stream just popped up with a warning. So I'm sorry if you can't hear me, but that's pretty much it. So send me a few Sims 3 gifts just so we can get like a backlog of some fun things to kind of add into that build. Cause I think that'd be something fun to do. But anyway, 
Kyle and I have to go because I have to vacuum my whole house every day because of Kyle's existence. So thank you so much for watching the stream. I really hope you had a good time. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you so much for the new members. Thank you so much for the super chats. I had a really good time. This has been like, this was the best possible way to celebrate my two years on YouTube. So two years and five-ish thousand subscribers. I forget now like because it's, like I said, it's just kind of overwhelming and kind of unbelievable. So I really enjoyed it. Thank you, Federica. Thank you, someone from Ukraine. Thank you, Fizzy Pop. Thank you, The Tomorrow Sim. Thank you, Kami Zarakai. Thank you, Ginger Cat Queen. Thank you, James. Thank you, Sims 3 GG. Thank you. Oh, Piano, I didn't see you. Hi, Pia. I didn't see you. I'm sorry. It was, it, it was good to see you. Cam, Tia, Samantha, thank you so much. I love each and every one of you. This is like a dream come true. So thank you so much for all the support. I can't believe I don't deserve it, but I'm getting it. So I'm going to relish in it. So that's really all we 